Hey everybody, how's it going? Uh, it's weird that we're doing Yakuza on a day that isn't Friday, but you know what? This week I felt like maybe we should do a double bill of Yakuza. Mostly because I really do want to try and continue the story, and I feel like because we put a lot of time into it on Fridays, I figured tonight we would uh, do the side stuff and also do the... I'd hopefully get done with the Real Estate Royale because I really want to get that done. We have been spending way too much time on this thing. So, as you can see, as soon as it comes up, I've been a busy boy uh, in between last stream of this and today. Because I basically have spent the time standing here uh, grinding up money for basically what's going to uh, basically become uh, just spending money to get all the Gambling Keen Area's uh, locations as well as buy some new moves because I do need to actually start investing into my combat skills a bit. I've been only uh, getting money from the areas that we have already uh, collected, so that way when I haven't gotten any progress in the le in the gambling cane area. So before we do anything, let's get paid from there. And of course there'll be a money battle. Looking egg. I've actually learned that it's best not to just keep pouring money into it and just to sparingly uh, save your character. Alright, let's have you guys back up there. So now everything's collected money. And I guess there's also something I can talk about that I did in between last stream and now. I went around all of the of the Leisure Cane area, and I finally figured out where the hell that one missing place was. It was the... it was... it was something Academy. What was its name? Uh, Noki Noki Academy, that was it. <sighs> Turns out we've been walking past it so many times, because it's literally right next to the office. I kept r running past it because this guy, uh, they hide the building behind him. Because I kept thinking, I don't want to talk to this guy because he's just going to give me handkerchiefs. Nope, pretty, o pretty old for an adult place, but it seems popular. What should I do? Only a pitiful 10 million, so yeah, of course I'm going to buy it. Alright. Now that that is done, let's head back to the Gambling King District and start buying up some property. We still need to get ourselves... Let's pull this back up again real quick. We need the Leisure Hall, and... Really? That's it? Just the Leisure Hall? Huh. I've been busier than I thought last week. God, it has been way too long. And thank God the weekend is finally here, because I am super happy about it. So let me buy this Leisure Hall real quick, and then we'll start investing into some combat things. Because a, a couple of other things I have discovered is uh new heat moves uh i know there's people who are veterans of this game that are probably getting angry that i haven't been getting certain uh skills in the in the skill trees because you know why wouldn't i and it turns out some of the heat moves are uh related to the essence of blank so essence of the beast torment uh that is the heat move where we basically dislodge a guy's arms and then fling them around so, of course, I'm going to buy it. I'm going to get that. And, unfortunately, that's the only heat move that I think is in here. Let's see. Heat retention, heat wave. Heat retention. Yeah, it seems to be it. Uh, these are just basically combat moves. So, if anything heat-related, would either be uh, with the dark blue. Or maybe it's something we get through training. Which, it looks like we can get... One to two things of training. Let me actually invest a little bit more into Beast real quick and see if that actually does the trick. <laughs> what are you going to do? Stab me? Yes. No. All right. If anything, I want to get some more health. Just keep getting all that health. Even more health. I don't care if it's a billion. Push power in throwing enemies and objects. Oh, the bear hug. That's something I also wanted to get. All 
All right, third heat bar, uh, guard, and then press B when attacked. Okay. All right, that's still got a ways to go. That still has a ways to go. So did those. Combo resist allows you to perform a resist guard when the enemy attacks during a rush combo. And there's the clothesline. Hey, you know what? Those are actually pretty cheap. All right, uh, let's see. Still got a ways to go. Still ways to go. Still ways to go. That's the only thing that we need to get the master right now. And then there's that right there. And unfortunately, we can't really do anything with this because we uh, need to unlock this uh, skill right here. So for now, uh, let's go to... What was it? Brawler? Brawler. And let's just start spending a lot more into this because I want to try and see if I can max out Brawler tonight. Just go, keep getting heat retentions. Become an alcoholic. Get some more combos. XXXXY, then Y on the third heat bar. Counter hook, watch a counter attack when the enemy comes at you. The fewer heat bars are filled, the more powerful the attack will be. Guard, then why when the enemy attacks? And that looks like it doesn't take any heat, which is, you know, really good. Dull senses, kick combo, pressure the enemy with a powerful combo, this uses up the heat gauge. Why, then why, why in heat mode? And only on the second and third bar. Okay. Breakaway throw, throw an enemy uh, when they grab you. Great tiger. Get more quick step distance because I think the quick step for Brawler is actually pretty pitiful. Draw upon the energy deep within you to withstand the attacks that would normally knock you down. Yes. Well, I should perform a series of grab combo attacks and just keep beating the ever living hell out of people in, in the second heat bar. Further boost the damage of your counter attacks, X or Y when attacked in the third heat bar. Not bad. Alright, and I think for the last of our money, we're just going to spend it on health. And also, Dragon Spirit. And also, uh, Tortoise Spirit. Alright, that is everything we can afford here. Is there anything that we can spend on in Rush? Yes. Get this, get this. Don't... I, I probably could have had enough for... Yeah, I could have gotten at least one combo. Oh, well. Step out. Evasive move adds to the actions after a rush combo. Adds effect after X rush combo. Oh, is it like uh, you beat enemies up and then carry a quick step away if they like take a swing at them or something? Hmm. Eh, I got the money. Might as well splurge. Okay, invested three billion into Beast, five billion into Brawler, and five hundred thousand or five million into Rush. We are set to go. Uh, what are we close to right now? I could go disco dancing. I could go to the Pocket Circuit, which I will have to do eventually. There's a thing right here. I think I might swing back by the office real quick. Then we'll go talk to Baracus, and then we'll just make our way back up through the shopping area up to that guy. Whew, okay. That's the plan. Invest, train, and then beat the crap out of people because that's what Kiryu usually do, uh, does. How many skill points do I have? 13. Well, I might have to pay a visit to the temple soon. Oops, excuse me. Pardon me. Walking meat slab coming through. Alright, payday. Still got a ways to go for gambling, though. But we should be able to invest at least. Uh, 
I'm gonna wait a few seconds just so that way we can get uh, pleasure up as well. Okay, that should be good. Yes, yes. Make a little bit of money back. Alright. Uh, that needs new security. Who's good to go? Jaguar. Security is A for that, but that's the last day we can get security for them. Security is B. And that's the last day for both of them. Alright. Oh, break. Nope. I don't want to talk to you. I want to invest. Alright, uh, and seeing as how I don't really have to worry about money for buying up properties right now, let's see. Uh, you know what, I'm actually gonna go all in when it comes to investing. Get that up to B, there we go. As business, so we shall get Masura. Or Marusa, I, keep, I don't know why I keep saying Masura. Miracle Worker Magic. A lot of activity areas, uh, which makes sense. I think there's only like two uh, food places and like one... Or no, there's uh, two business. Still business. Hot dog, there's food. And I think Mama's the best person for food. Yeah, it looks like she's the only uh, double person. Oh, that's two food. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah, soba. Makes sense. Lock bowl. That is bowling. Nope, nope. Where's Miracle? There you are. Alright. And the only other thing to invest in right now is uh, the Noki Noki Academy. And that is a love location, huh? Alright. Uh, Pleasure King. Woo! Woo! Oh, shit! <laughs> Yeah, that's definitely going to be just a, a double uh, investment. And then we should have that maxed out pretty fast. But hey, we're making progress. Almost everything is all maxed out, and then we will take on the fourth king. Alright, hold on. I need to beat up some people. Who knows, maybe there's a... Uh, pole laying on the ground somewhere? No, I do not see a pole. Alright, uh... Oh, jeez! That is pretty good! Alright, uh... Oh, not business, abilities. Oh, right, uh, beast. Come on. Oh, okay, that's a bear hug. Come on, take a swing, take a swing. Give me those arms! Ah, jeez. As someone who's been lifting heavy stuff all day, I can't tell if the pain came from watching that or just from work, period. Uh, stamina in. Alright. All right, Brockus, what do you got for me? Hey, bye. Yes. Uh, what do we do when we're backed up against the wall, or how can I launch a finisher from combo? I want to learn about this first. This seems fun. Okay. Hmm, you have some powerful combinations at your disposal now. A little extra polish, and you'll be unstoppable. Extra polish? What do you mean by that? I've seen you unleash some nasty backhand blows, but I think you can give them an even stronger follow-through. Huh. I call it the, a power finish. Essence of finishing blows. That's a pretty bland name. It's a finisher. Best to keep it simple. I guess so. 
Hey. Yo. Oh, you Brockus, the name's... Ah, uh, perfect timing. Look what we got here. Another hitman, I bet. What? See if we can take this guy down with what we talked about, boy. But by the look of him, it should be a cinch. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. Huh? I'll make you eat those words. Just you wait. <laughs> He's just a local tax collector. I, I'm here for your tax return. He wasn't a hitman to begin with. This reckless attack is exhausted after performing a backhanded finishing blow. Ooh. X, 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 Y. Oh, that's not it. X, 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 uh, Y, and then Y. X, X, X. I, I hit a four combo. That's why. Alright, come on. Get up. X, X. X, 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 Y. What? Is it because he's guarding? Up oh, there it is. Oh, and for the flying haymaker. Kiryu, why didn't you punch him? Nope, that's not it. I think it's because I'm accidentally hit uh, doing the four X combo instead of three. All right. Ow. One, two, three. No, that is not what you are supposed to be doing, Kiryu. One. One, two, three. Nope. One, two, three. Punch. And I'm not doing it. One, two, three. There it is. Down you go! Alright, bike, 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 bike! Oh wow, that is actually a, a lot of distance now. Alright, hold on. Here, you look hungry. Here, have a snack! to look at. <laughs> what heap art does that uh, require? Is it two? Uh, after a certain finishing blow, grab the enemy again and deliver a savage strike that uses up the heat gauge. X, 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 Y, then B on the third heat bar. Right, let's try this move. <laughs> Just kick him in the face. Jeez, Kiryu. How's he still breathing after all that punishment? Must must be tough as a tank. Yeah. Looks like the fight's gone out of him, though. He won't need any more convincing. Hmm. He's taking this well for a hitman. I'm no hitman. I was sent by the Raymond Cartel. 
Ramen cartel? What's that? You'll find out. Oh, you'll find out soon enough. Brock is here. Can tell you all about it. See you around, Cosmic Kiryu. Ugh, uh, oh, everything's broken. Mm. How did he know my name? What's the story here, Brockus? I'm not ready to tell you yet. Hey. At least now we know who's sending these hitmen, and that my life isn't in danger. Besides, we still have more training to do. Until next time. Alright, only one more move. Hey, bye. Alright, final training. And that would be... Uh, what do I do when I'm backed against the wall? Okay. Having your back up against the wall is just like getting cornered in boxing. Uh. I've only seen boxing on TV, but it looks hard to get away once you're trapped in a corner. Usually, you end up getting knocked out. Yeah. Exactly. If you get cornered, your opponent has the upper hand. You'll need something special to turn the tables. The move I'm going to teach you wouldn't fly in the ring, but it's incredibly powerful in the street fight. What kind of move? It takes advantage of having a wall at your back. You evade and kick at the last moment, and follow through with a game-changing blow. I call it the Bone Cruncher. Uh, I, don't, I don't like the sounds of that. Essence of Wall Smashing. Interesting. So, just when the opponent thinks they have you on the ropes, it, it lets their, it lets down, they let down, and lets down their guard, you hit them with a punishing counterattack. That's right, when you're cornered, you have to recognize the right moment to take advantage of an enemy attack. Attacking blindly isn't the only way to win a fight. You're Baracus, huh? Ah, this should be interesting. Another newcomer here to kill you? What's so interesting about that? I know him. He's a former champion who cast aside glory and became a mafia muscle. I got bored in the rain, so I went to where the real fighting happens. No. Meh. And here I was hoping you'd step down from for a better reason than that. How shallow. Shallow, you say? Bacchus? No matter how skilled a fighter, when they duke it out for petty reasons, it's nothing but violence. I hate fighters like that more than anything. Ha! Huh. Keep a sermon to yourself, old man. Time to tidy up this old task and head out for cel for celebratory drinks. Uh? Couldn't have said it better myself. Come on, then. Alright, what do we got? Evade an enemy's attack, then smash the bones in their leg. Ah! This strike is enough to make any troublemaker regret getting out of bed. Press Y when you're back to a wall. Mm. Mm. Yep, that one hurts. That one hurts a lot. Here you, please. Ugh. Man, just stay down. Just stay down for for your own sake. It hurts so much to look at. Come on, take a swing, take a swing. And no more leg. There it is. Nope, that's not it. I mean, it's something, but it's still not what I wanted. How was it to do the, the break the counterattack move? Uh, let's see, I think it was like blue. There are certain finishing blows. Grab the enemy XXXY, then B on the third heat bar. 
Sword of Spirit, Kick Combo. Was it purple? Essence of Face Twist Twitching. Slip Hat. Alright, uh, why in front of a guarding enemy? Third Heat Bar. Kiryu, what are you doing? I'm not even hitting the A button. One, two, three. One, two, three. Alright, that's what I have to do. I really wanted to see if I can pull off that one combo that we got. This guy just loved the guard. Ouch! No! I think you're taking this a bit far, boy. That's even rougher around the edges than I showed you. Hands and feet make pretty deadly weapons when used right. Just because you don't carry a knife or a gun doesn't mean I'll go easy on you. Yeah, I get that. You failed at your task. Don't ever show your face in front of us again. Oh, oh God. I'm going to need a splint for this one. Ow. 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 Hey. Something got your goat boy? Maybe. What? I was just thinking, there isn't much difference between me and the type of guy that you hate. I only know how to solve problems through violence. I could end up like that guy one day. No. You're too young for your path to be set in stone, boy. I know. Still. People are swayed by those around them. You may think your decisions are your own, but others leave their mark. I've already learned a lot of things from you, for example. You learned from me? Yes. Sure, no matter how old you get, there's always more to learn. The way you carry yourself is a po positive influence on me, for instance. No kidding? I thought I was the one doing all the learning here. Life is a precious thing. It isn't always easy, but we do what we can to survive, and that's what you need to focus on now. I hear that. I need to learn a few more of your moves. Stick with me until I master them all. <laughs> of course, always happy to help. <laughs> There's nothing else for me to teach you, boy. Congratulations on your graduation. Mm. So that's it, huh? It's all over? Say, boy. How would you like to give combat sports a real shot? I think you'd make a fine boxer, and I would know. Here we go again. Listen, Bacchus. What? Why do you want me to turn into a pro fighter so badly? Because I see the makings of a champion you. If you just put the work in, the sky's the limit. You could be rolling in cash. I'm sure there's tons of people who could pull that off, though. Well, yes and no, I admit. I've got an eye for talent. I see. I've seen raw talent rise up all over the world. Then why me? Your potential is greater than those of any ch any of those champs. The kids I train have to be able to hold their own in, in the street, too. But why a street fight? None of that applies in a ring where there are actual rules. That's assuming you only fight in the ring. What's that supposed to mean? I tell you, kid, most of the money I owe was borrowed from the Mafia, stateside. And they don't play by the rules. The Mafia? You went and borrowed cash from criminals like that? No wonder they're chasing you halfway around the world. I can explain that. See, I used to run a gym where I trained young boxers with, with promise. One day, one of my fighters went up against a guy who was in the Mafia's pocket, of course. There was a lot of off-the-book off the bets riding on the fight. They were gambling on it, huh? My trainee was a nobody, but everyone but to everyone's surprise, he came out of nowhere and knocked the guy flat on his ass, and that's where it all started. He pissed off the mob. First, they recruited the guy I was training and put him in the in their own damn gym. I mean, it came as a shock, but what could I do? They could bankroll him far better than I ever could. Pretty common tale in the sports world. Next thing I know, my gym goes up in smoke after a fire broke out from a gas leak. I was heartbroken. Wait, they burned down your gym? I was down, but not out. This old iron heart took out a loan to rebuild the gym. I applied a, f 
I applied at a financing company and was completely that was completely legit. But the mafia put some pressure on them and suddenly they're they're the ones carrying my loan. So the mob bought out your debt from the bank. And that's how you came to owe them all that money? Yep. Sure didn't think they'd go that far to get revenge. It was all downhill from there. Mafia goons would show up at my gym every day to intimidate my clientele until I didn't have a single boxer left. What did you do? You can do the math. No fighters, no lessons, no money, no money, no bouts, no titles, no nothing. I was done. I had one ray of hope in that dark time, and that was this kid who stuck with me. Through th the thick of it, he was dead set on getting that title belt with me. Then one day, while he was out doing his day job on some road work, he got mugged, shanked, and he didn't make it. Don't tell me the Mafia was behind that too. I figured it was just bad luck on top of the cruel fate, but then a Mafia lawyer showed up to defend the killer. I understand now why you'd want your next fighter to have some street smarts too. Yes, yes. But what'd you do to piss them off so much? The betting thing only happened once, right? I don't get why they'd chase you to the ends of the earth for that. Actually, I figured that out just recently. They don't want me dead, they want me alive for my services. I don't understand. I should have realized it so much earlier. All the talent I just find just ends up signing up with those Mafia bastards. You think their aim is to get the skilled fighters you find to sign up with them? That makes the most sense. Perhaps the guys behind you can fill us in. Huh? <laughs> I'd love immediate cut to the dramatic music. Mr. Kiryu. You work for the mob, huh? That's right. I'm with the Raymond Cartel, Eastern Division. Why don't you call it what it is? Mafia. No, this is Yakuza, Bacchus. I, I know you might have had a few too many to drink, but still, remember what series you're in. If you're not here to kill me, then you came for the kid, huh? Exactly. The hitmen we sent here were to test Cosmic Kiryu's metal. But today, you're all here together. That means he's passed your tests, and you're here to take him with you. Cosmic Kiryu. We've already notified at headquarters that Bacchus considers you his top fighter. First I've heard of it. When did Bacchus tell you that? He didn't have to. He only calls his most talented uh, finds boy. You're, the, you're only the second to earn that title. That's enough to make you a prime recruit in our eyes. You let me wander the world so you could swoop in as soon as you I called a, a kid boy? The choice is yours, Cosmic Kiryu. Either you play it smart and sign up with us, or... Hell no. You may want to reconsider. Pride will be the death of you, so I suggest you swallow it. Uh? I said no. You drive a hard bargain. How about you come with us, and we'll let Bacchus live. We'll let the old fool just walk away. I already know you won't harm him. You won't dare kill the Golden Goose your HQ values so much. Enough empty threats. Tch. Trust a former Yakuza to see through that. I guess the little tricks won't work. But this time, you're up against five of our best. With your life at stake, surely you can see that accepting our offer is your only option. Mm. I, I have dropped motorcycles on guys for less reasons than you. I don't seem to be getting through to you, so let me make this clear. You're the ones who decide your fate as soon as you walk down that alley. Now quit wasting your breath and come on! Uh, fine, have it your way. <laughs> oh god, pissed off Kiryu's back. You go against the mob, you get erased. I need to grit my teeth harder. Oh god, one's got a shotgun. Uh, ah, damn, one has a sword. I wanted to try that new uh, fighting technique. Oh well. Ow. Alright, hold on, hold on. Give me this. Oh, right in the gut. Okay, this is starting to get annoying. Ooh, these gun guys. Alright, I need to take care of these guys with guns first. Ow. 
Oh, there's three guys with guns. That's why. Ah, come on, come on. I just want to drop this card on your head. There we go. That's one down. Oh, right, right in the kidney. There's two. Ow. Never killed a single person. Oh, right. Uh, ah, wait, there it was. Hold on. Come on, take a swing, take a swing. Do it, do it. There we go. Where was that knife? Oh, I don't need a knife. I got a shotgun. Okay, maybe I need the knife. I can't find that knife. Fine. You know what else I... I have a, a bike. Hmm. Bike wasn't enough. All right, fine. I cast... Go oh, wait. It's out of ammo. Okay, probably should heal. You couldn't sign me up or kill me. You bring blades and guns, yet still fail. You better give it a rest. You won the battle, not the war. We'll be back. Well, that takes care of that. What will you do now, Bacchus? How about joining me on the world stage, boy? Bathe in the spotlight and become a champion fighter. Plenty of cash to be won. Doesn't that tickle your fancy at all? I don't know. I can't imagine that kind of life, but I do know it isn't what I should be doing now. Yeah? A man I owe my life to is in trouble. Helping him is my first and only priority. Ah. Sounds like nothing I could say would change your mind. Okay, I understand. I won't nag you anymore. I think I'll leave Japan. At least, until you've done what needs to do. Where will you go next? Back to the States. It seems like the Mafia have their eyes on me, so I might as well introduce them to my top picks next. Isn't that playing right into their hand? Beats having assassins on my, tra on my, ta uh, on my trail. And if there's a young fighter with a dream out there, I can make that happen. Using the Mafia's pull to your advantage, huh? Smart. <laughs> Well, I figure I owe them plenty, so why not help them out a little, eh? <laughs> well, I hope you produce a few champions. Well, you've got some youth left in yourself, boy. If you ever want to walk the path of the champion, you just let me know. Uh. Sure, got it. Bacchus later found dead in Sotenbori. See ya! I'll be seeing you then, boy. Well, that is everything for Brawler. Oh. Hmm? oh. Wait, we're in the park. That means there should be a pull around here. I can try out that new heat move. Hello? There it is. Urgh. Oh, yep. Yeah. Oh, he's dead. He is super dead. He is incredibly dead. <laughs> he also kind of ragdolled. Yeah, you should be scared. And so should you. Come here. Come here. Oh, you think you can hit me and just get away with that? Tombstoned. Oh, that reminds me, I do need to visit the pharmacy. Alright, uh, 
let's see, business, everything's ready to pay out, so let us go and do that real quick. He's throwing more money at him. Oh, we're so close. Alright, first things first, let's start investing. Oops, I didn't mean to use Kyo. So, I think after this, we should be able to take on the Gambling King. That's B, 92. This should put us at a 94 if we can get this up to A rank. Uh, yep, there we go. Nope, oh, wait. Yep, now it's 94. Soba is now an S rank. Alright, that's everything there, and the only other thing to invest in is right here. And now we're done. Alright, uh, let's see. Managers, let's put... Um, Mass Spain's already working on pleasure. Uh, let's put Nugget up there. Oh. Jaguar is good for the week. Uh, Sachiko, we can swap you out with... Uh, who, who do we got? Mm, I want to save Papillon for... Uh, gambling. He's garbage, but after uh, the grinding that I did to get the money to invest and also buy the remaining properties... Uh, he's actually really good when it comes to the high-level stuff. It just takes a while for him to get there. Uh, we'll put Leisure in charge of uh, Pleasure. Also need to get new security. Man, I need to get a lot more security because the ones I have, aside from like a few, are pretty bad, I have to say. Jaguar's good. Kukuchi, yeah, he is good. Although his problem solving is garbage, I probably should give him a break. Eh, after this. Please leave! Okay, fine, I'll leave. Jeez, you shank a guy with a 2x4 and everybody just starts getting angry at you. Hmm? Yo, how's it going? Hey, you're... You're the guy who let me... Who let me into the Catfight Arena, right? Heh. <laughs> Aw, you remembered me. How sweet. What's going on here, Mr. President? I know you have a wild and very net, uh, a wide and very network. You have a homeless friends too. Well, we're not exactly friends, more like acquaintances. So, what brings you here? I got a message for you from the Gambling King. The Gambling King? Yeah, heard you gobbled up quite a lot of the Gambling King's turf. You do realize he's really pissed, right? He's waiting at his turf now. Says he wants to settle things once and for all. Settle things? Well, I figured he realized he can't beat you in business, so he'll have to resort to something riskier to win. He always says he'll do anything to be the last one standing. That's his policy. I bet he's putting his money... Uh, I'm betting he's putting his money on getting rid of you and winning everything back. 
Besides, the five billionaires all resorted to things like this that get ahead. Resort to things like that to get ahead in the first place. Uh oh, why are we dropping frames? Yes, we are. Why are we dropping frames? What the hell's going on? Why are we dropping frames? What is going on? Stop it. Stop it. Uh, is everything affected? Doesn't look like it, right? Hold on. Alright, why are we dropping frames? What is going on here? Oh god, now we just lost everything. Start Wednesday, April. The fuck off. Okay, we should be back now. Let me just make sure everything's running again. Alright, there we go. Okay, so, sorry about that. Uh, the issue that happened last week, uh, it, yeah, it happened again. And I don't know why, because this has never happened before. <clears throat> but I can see as I lost connection, Dragon raided, so I'm just going to throw this up real quick. Well, I make sure everything's working right, and why is it not popping up? What the hell is going on here? Is the quick rate not up there? Right there it is. Why is it not showing? What the hell? There we go. <laughs> Thank you for the ray dragon. Hope your stream went well. Uh, I see that you were playing the SpongeBob movie game. Uh, hopefully that is going well for you, dude. And I see you're in chat. And I can't believe you raided when the stream bore. T I can believe it. <clears throat> All right. Uh, let's see where we left off. Uh, we just got challenged to a fight by the Gambling King. Time for us suck. Yeah, th that's how they usually do that. Those are my exact same thoughts when I played uh, Slide 1 and had to do the time trials in that game. Time trials always suck. Unless you know what you're doing. And then they suck, but not as hard. <clears throat> Anyways, uh, you know you're gonna die if you go there. You and the girly here should just elope and get out of town. Huh? What? I I elope? Me and the president? What on earth are you saying? <laughs> it's... It's so sudden. B but if you really want to, Mr. President, maybe we could. Hey, I'm not eloping with anyone. She... <laughs> Her face is just like... Why do you hurt me in these ways, Kiryu? Why can't you just accept our love? What the hell? Oh, it was just a dashboard. Hold on. Hold on. I'm, I'm making cursed content again. Ooh, ooh, oh, God. Oh, nope. Nah. <laughs> just She's just imagining him in the classes. <laughs> Kiryu. Please. Accept my love. Alright. <laughs> this awkward silence is actually pretty awkward. No matter what the enemy stoops to, I'm not gonna run. I'll crush them. Dirty tricks and all. That's my policy. <laughs> huh, is that right? You kinda make me wanna be in your corner. You're a strange guy. 
All right, I've done my part and gave you the message, so it's time for me to split. Try not to die out there, buddy. Uh. Yeah, thanks. I'm gonna leave with my very low poly gel. Wow, that is really bad texture on that outfit. I can't tell if it loaded improperly or if it just looks that bad. <laughs> I just don't like losing my customers, that's all. I'm expecting you back at the arena, you hear? See ya. The Gambling King's turf is near Mock Bowl. I'll go as soon as I'm ready. Hmm? What's wrong? Hmm, nothing. What's up with her? You might know your way around again, but when it comes to women, you're clueless, Kiryu. I've been saying that all all series. All right, during a billionaire's challenge, you can't do anything while until we uh, beat the billionaire. Me, whenever I make a very bad joke around Moon, she's just like, hmm. Alright, up by Mach Bowl. Do I have a... Nope, not yet. We all have, and when he... When does he think he's reading them right? He gets a right instead. <laughs> Alright, if it's gonna be grandiose, I feel like it's gonna be, like, out in, like, the main square area. Unless it's where we thought it is... Uh... Well, that doesn't look ominous. Oh, you're approaching me? Well, I can't get my property back if you're just, uh, all the way over here. Hold on. Wait. Wait. Cool. Got a card. Oh, then come as close as you want. God, it's like he's wearing a camo made out of money. There you are, cute to you. Are we gonna put an end to this? Mm. Yeah, exactly. You read my mind. I got to admit, I underestimated you. I didn't wager you'd be this good at management. My back's up against the wall thanks to you. At this rate, I'm going to lose, but I'm all about doing whatever it takes to win and be the last man standing. Uh? So I'm going to kill you right here and now and take everything back. <laughs> <laughs> Resorting to violence when the chips are down, huh? You're just as rotten as the rest of the billionaires. Say whatever you want, girly man. I don't care what anyone says about how I did it. I'm going to win it. Let's make a final bet. If you survive this fight, I'll give you my area and everything I have. If you die, I'll take everything you own. What do you think? Pretty good gamble, am I right? Are you sure you want to give me that much of a handicap? Huh? With these rules, I have the advantage. I'm stronger than you, after all. You really know how to push my buttons, don't you, boy? Fine, I... Oh, fine, I accept your challenge. Brain it! Prepare to be terminated! Alright, uh, since you're here, Dragon, I need to show off this new, uh, move I got. I also... Oh, wow, they're just beating the hell out of me. First things first, I need to get my heat up. Ow. I think this might work. All right. All right, take a, take a swing, take a swing. Okay, maybe it is uh, third heat. Or maybe over here. Come on, come on, take a swing. All right, I guess maybe it's in a bad area. Oh, wait, maybe over here would do it. All right, come on, come on, take a swing. Okay, it must be uh, third heat bar. Alright, come on, take a swing. Come on, swing! There we go! No more leg! Alright, let's see. One, two, three. Ah, damn it. I want to do that flying haymaker. One, two, three. 
Okay, this is getting ridiculous. All right, you know what? Enough of this. You, come here. Aw, oh, what's the matter? Your friends all gone? Oh, what a shame. Hold on. I need I need to take a quick drink. Yes, another. And another. Alright, there we go. Alright, what to beat you with? Oh, I know. I want to get my heat back up real quick. Oh, wait. Is he a rush fighter? I figured with him, he would be more of a beast style. Yeah, he fights like a rush fighter. Alright, this will work. Uh, okay. Not the bear hug, although that was pretty good. Come on, come at me. Come on, take a swing, take a swing. One swing, there we go. Give me those arms. Alright, let's see if we can finish off with a flying haymaker. If I can hit him. Oh, nope. Just beat the ever-living hell out of him. I think that's the first time we've ever gotten our suit bloodied. Wow, I am just covered in blood. Looks like I won. Haha, <laughs> sure looks like it, boy. I didn't think you had it in you. It's been a while since I lost a bit big lost big on a bet. But a loss is a loss. You won my area and my fortune. What king is left? Uh media. Which means you know what that means. We gotta for his challenge it's definitely gonna be disco with the way he dresses. That's very sports sportsmanlike of you. Yeah. I told you before, right? When you gamble, you just gotta be the last man standing. I lost everything today, but this isn't the end for me. I'll start. Uh, I, I'm. It's weird. I'm kind of breaking out of Arnold and going into Scandinavian. I lost everything today, but this isn't the end for me. I'll start over from scratch and claw my way back up to the top. And once I'm there, I'll take you down. I can. You can bet on it. So I take back what I said about putting an end to this. I lost today, but one of these days I'll be back and try my luck against you once again. <laughs> yeah, sure, that's fine. But when you call your way to the top next time, don't use any dirty tricks. Do it fair and square, and I'll accept your challenge. <laughs> fine, I got it. Watching you, I guess it's possible to be making uh, to make money running a business on the straight and narrow. Maybe I'll try it out. You really think I can change? If you don't change, you'll never be able to win against me. Heh. <laughs> <laughs> then that settles it, lad. I gotta change. <laughs> Hola, Gambling King baby! You lost, huh? Lame. Ha ha ha! What the hell, Media King? You're here to yank my chain? Oh, no, no, no! I'm here to give you the heads up. And? Ah. Well, before your little showdown, what is up with his eyes? He is coked out of his mind. Us five billionaires took the liberty of confiscating all your properties and funds. It's like what? Someone probably thought you were gonna lose. If you lost and gave away your fortune and pro property out of some twisted sense of chivalry, he'd be what? He'd only become a bigger threat to the rest of us. You, you bastard! Anyway, Kiryu-san, was it? Sucks to be you. This guy is just an empty shell. Even if he gives you everything he's got, that's not a whole lot anymore. Really? Isn't the gambling king one of you? You're just... Dis you're dis uh, discarding him just like you did the leisure king. Some group you are. Alright, fine. Uh, hold on. 
Yeah, that's right. If you're not willing to do whatever it takes, you can't make it big in this shit show of a world. Ooh, I am coked out of my mind, mm, cocaine. Well then, adios, former gambling king, ex-billionaire, and you too, Mr. Kiryu. I'm gonna go do more coke. Mmm, love me some cocaine. Uh -huh. Damn it, those bastards. I'm going to get them. Hey, Kiryu-san, would you mind letting me help you out at your play place? I want to give them some payback. So glad I wasn't drinking the water when I did that. <laughs> Besides, working for you might help me turn myself around. Uh. I can see that. Welcome aboard. Alright, we got ourselves a new manager. He is garbage on the first day, but he actually gets better as the days goes on. Which makes sense. The five billionaires are ruthless. Is the media king actually the one controlling them? Box have been unlocked for the rush style. It's still weird that he's a rush fighter and not a uh, not a beast fighter. You wouldn't think of that looking at him. Ah, that was impeccable timing on taking care of the gambling king. I'm I'm in oh wait that was oh wait, yeah I'm impressed. <laughs> Don't you think timing is everything in the business world? <laughs> it requires a toast of souls. <laughs> Uh, let's see, timing is everything in the business world. The important thing is to remain three of, uh, free of emotion or empathy. Do you understand? Those things only get in the way of making money. <clears throat> yes. But my, the five billionaires are few in numbers these days, aren't they? I will take care of Mr. Kiryu without fail. And then I'm going to swan dive into the biggest pile of cocaine. I suppose I'll have something to look forward to then. If you fail, I'll discard you without a moment's hesitation. Nothing personal. I hope you don't mind. I'll go get ready for him now. Uh, where, where's that cocaine? Mm, love me some cocaine. They're all worthless. Well, it's about time for me to put my next plan into motion. Ah, you're here. Come on in, old friend. No, I recognize that suit anywhere. I've been waiting for you, Yamanoi. Do you have a voice to match uh, Tamo's Mr. Libido? I can't pull off the the voice Tamo does for Libido. Mostly because because she likes to alternate between it. I can't pull off uh, poshness, and I can't pull off uh, whatever the hell Majima's one was. Nope, hold on. I'm just gonna... Wow, they took forever to uh, realize I was going past them. And I'm gone. Though I mean, is your media king's voice one to match Tamas Mr. Lobito's voice? Oh, maybe. Uh. Oh, Mr. President, you defeated the four of the five billionaires now. Uh. Yeah, the media king is the only one still standing. <laughs> I've made preparations so we can purchase property in the media king's area. Our opponent's strong, but we can do it. Well, 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 Yamanoe-san, you got some explaining to do. Is there anything I can help you? Nah. Yes, I want you to repaint everything, but also make it the same. And I see you're not wearing your glasses. All right. We have got a lot of oh wow it's already starting in the mil into the millions jeez what do we have in that area already the Tokiwa restaurant and that is a food area so let's get Mama on that all right let's get the pail. Man, everybody is just doing bad in this economy. Well, Nugget's doing better now. Uh, Sachiko, she can be swapped out. Let's put electronics in her area. 
Leisure, you can keep working that. All right, let's start investing real quick. It's like that one episode of SpongeBob where Krabs turns the Krusty Krab into a hotel and Squidward has them paint the room and ends up having them just go back to what it originally was. I didn't make the connection until now, but damn it, Dragon, that's actually pretty accurate. Fine, give me B. Ah, so close. Oh, this will definitely be A. This. Oh, give me A next time, and this is definitely going to take a while to get to S. Nope. 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 There we go. Perfect! This is exactly the way it started! Alright, and we already got the Soba Plays maxed out. Uh, let's get Miracle, where are you? There you are. And was that everything? Yes. Get to collecting. I need to swap out security. Damn it. And staff-wise, let's put... Uh, who can we put? Sachiko. You can work here. Security will put you in charge of there. And might as well collect what we can. Oh god, I am scared of what how much things are going to be for here, because this is the last district. So I'm guessing there's going to be one that's at least in the billions. I think at the minimum 500 million. All right. What are all the places that we need to get? Oh, Media King's up. Huh. I figured Media King would be in that uh, corner on the right next to gambling. It just looks so weird now. It's just it's just like one big jaw over that one area. Okay. Uh, Disco City Boy, uh, Camarocho Hot Springs, Hotel Blue Light, Hotel Mermaid, uh, The Theater, Rainbow, Hotel Diamond Place, Hotel White, and the Pocket Circuit Stadium, which means I'm going to have to, uh, do the Pocket Circuit, uh, story. But, alright. Doesn't seem that bad. We'll just scout the area out for now, and there are a couple of side stories up there we could also knock out while we're there. Miracle will probably be pretty useful here. Probably. That is, if we can actually find the places first. That's the batting area. I want to check here real quick. Because I think that a weapon that we can get for a uh, specific heat move is unlocked through doing the batting cage. Alright, let's see what we got. Steel Shin Guards, Metal Bat, Turner, Turner, Patriarch's Bat, Immovable Belt, Toughness, Yakuza Training Gear, Head Gear, nope. I need to figure out where the hell I can find Brass Knuckles. It's supposed to range that. No, do not say the S word. Do not say that S word, Dragon. I refuse to acknowledge it. I refuse. Here's a place. Hotel White. It's an older facility, but it's well known, so it still gets plenty of business. <laughs> Jeez, I was joking when I said at least won't be in your billion. Hotel Diamond pa Palace. This place is popular with the younger crowd. Jeez! Whoop. Out of my way. It's like crabs when he has to spend anything. Not so much because I have to spend anything, more like because I have to spend me nearly a billion to get it. Oh, you got a, a baton. I want it. Give it to me. 
I will take that. And bonk. I didn't want to do a heat move. I want to break his leg. Sure, <laughs> you, you dumbass. Oh, nice, Dragon. Congrats. Alright, don't mind me. I'm just bleeding internally. Is there a food place I can eat around here? Oh, it's all the way down there. It, I'm okay. Maybe. Possibly. I could really use some food right about now. No. 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 No! Ah, oh, he lost his sword. Alright, you know what? Enough of this. Oh, what? What? What the? Ooh! Oh, jeez, Kiryu! Jeez! That's a new one. I don't remember ever seeing that one. Lion Haymaker. <laughs> wow, I made him spin with that one. Actually, spin. Uh, all right. Uh, taxi. Oh, thank God you're cheap. Uh, I need a place where I can go eat, uh, down there, Tenkichi. At least down there I can get food, because I think there's a, the, the sushi place is right next to the cab. Boy, am I hungry. I tell you what. Alright, give me food. Uh, what, what, what's the most filling thing you got? Otoro. This is the richest cut of my top grade bluefin tuna. It'll melt in your mouth. I think it will S word that I'm not going to say to curse myself. I can feel the cold air coming through the window open. Well, it, at least it, there might be cold air. That's all that really matters because it's been way too hot lately. Alright. Back to real estate. And I think collection is done already. Let me check. Uh, still collecting and gambling in media, so we'll just hold off on that. Just, alright, fine, whatever. I don't care. Take me over there. No, I refuse to believe it. It's not gonna do that thing, and you can't make me think otherwise. Alright, we got some side stories over here we can visit. Alright, first things first, uh, who the hell are you? Hey there, want some mushrooms? Huh? Mushrooms? Heh <laughs> I got some great ones. Guaranteed to put a smile on your face. What he's Oh man, are we gonna get high? Mushrooms that'll put a smile on my face? Sorry, I'm not interested in that sort of thing. 
Come on. Why not give it a try at least? You won't find finer mushrooms anywhere. No, I'm good. Go ask someone else. I see. That's too bad. I still got the shiitake I have to eat too. Hey, you. Is it true you're selling mushrooms here? Ah, uh, customer. What kind of mushrooms are you looking for? Um, I've never done them before. I don't know much. So, can you recommend something? It's rare to find someone new to mushrooms. All the ones I stock are great, but let me think. How about enoki mushrooms? They're in season now. Enoki? Enoki? <laughs> I get it. You give him a regular name so nobody catches on, huh? Smart. Watch, he's actually just a, a mushroom salesman, and it's just like legit mushrooms, not the magic mushrooms. Huh? But Enoki is Enoki. What do you mean? I'm looking for the kind of mushrooms that'll make me feel good. Well, my Enoki mushrooms are top quality. Eat them in a hot pot and you'll feel good, all right. Uh. You're making fun of me because of my it's my first time? You want your face rearranged? No, I'm not making fun of you, and I don't want my face rearranged. Wait, this mushroom dealer. Boy. I'm now interested. Hey, that's enough. I get the feeling this guy is not the kind of mushroom dealer you're looking for. Huh? I don't get it. And who asked you, anyway? Wait, hear me out. Ugh. If you're not going to shut your mouth, I'll shut it for you. Fine by me. What what was that what was that little thing he was doing here? Just like eh 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 you want a piece of me? Alright, come on buddy. Come on. Come on. I'll make you feel real good. I punched his glasses off. Alright, come on, come on. There we go. Give me that leg! Mm. Still hurts to look at. What the fuck? This guy's ridiculous. Don't worry, I still fixed your glasses, though. Um, thanks for helping me. Well, I was defending myself. No, you're a lifesaver. Can I ask your name? It's Kiryu. Hehe, <laughs> <laughs> Kiryu-san, huh? Here, take this as my thanks. So you really do sell regular mushrooms, huh? That's what I said from the beginning. My mushrooms are guaranteed to put a smile on your face. Mm. That's exactly the kind of talk that confuses people. Look, you know there are mushrooms that make you hallucinate when you eat them, right? If you sell mushrooms in a shady part of town like Camarocho, people are bound to get mixed up. Why don't you sell them somewhere else? Hmm, it's just... Mm. What, is there some reason it has to be Camarocho? I want as many people as possible to enjoy my mushrooms. Tokyo is the best place to find lots of people, Kamurocho especially. Well, you're not wrong about that. I only just started out. If I pick up or if I pack up and leave now, I feel like I failed. I want to give it a bit more time. I see. Well, I won't stop you. Be careful though. You're a kind man, Kiryu-san. Thanks. They call me, uh, Kitajima, the shroomer. For magnificent mushrooms, Kitajima's your man. See you around then. Got to know the mushroom dealer. Interacting with him will gradually fill up friendship. You can check the status. I okay, buy mushrooms from him. Got it. And maybe a lady... No! Jeez, Mitsutake is expensive. Okay, it's the king of mushrooms, so it makes sense. Thanks for stopping by. Don't forget for magnificent mushrooms. Uh, so, do, do I eat them and get health? Help? Oh, okay. So they are food. I thought I had to like take them somewhere to either like sell or uh to like make special kinds of food. Ah, eh, you know what? Because I like this guy, we'll get a uh, matsutake. It barely made a dent in that friendship meter. Oh, and he's gone. <laughs> he's really trying his best. Come 
Alright, where do you move to now? Don't see him there, don't see him there. Definitely not down there. I think he, he might just, like, leave and come back every now and then, so I'd have to, like, enter a building and then leave. Alright, uh, I think we can actually get a rush move. Yeah, we can master that. We're close to that. We still got a ways to go with that one. And we're close to that one. And Beast. I think we can get a beat. Yeah, we can get one. Just one mushroom right now. Are Goombas based on shiitake mushrooms? Yes. Oh, oh no, that's been in black. Except the 100,000 yen course, Kiri-san. You got the money and skills to do this? Yeah. Alright, Kiryu. So you got the money and... Use in tip-top shape. Ready to drum up some business? You got it. But with the entropy of 100,000, I think we're only going to get guys drunk enough to have impaired judgment. I'll be holding that 100,000 then. Relax. I'm not fixing to do a runner on you. Listen up, people! It's everyone's favorite punch-out artist! Today, my apprentice Kiryu-san is taking on all comers. It's a hundred thousand yen a shot. You knock him down even once in 60 seconds and it's your money. Come on, come all! Better not be lying about doubling my money if I win. Wouldn't dream of it. But you do know the pay to pay the entry free up front. Sweet, I'm a gambling man, so let's gamble. Hi. Sure thing, good luck. Let me go over the rules. Alright, time limit, if you get knocked down or knocked out, you lose. If you hit the challenger, you also lose. Alrighty, let's fight. Or, let's dodge. I don't know why he's saying let's fight. I can't lay a blow on this guy. All right, let's go. Come on. Ooh, ow. All right, I need to be careful. He's actually laying a few blows on me. Come on. Come on, take a swing. Take a swing. Come on. Come on, do it. Do it, I'm right here. Ow. Okay, he actually did it. I'm too fast for you. I'm like lightning. They call me Lightning Kiryu. I'm lying. No one tells calls me that. Ooh. Come on. You got nothing. You got nothing. You got nothing. How do you move so fast? I don't get it. Nice effort there. Thanks for trying. Always happy to do a rematch. <laughs> Good work, Kiryu san. You as quick as the wind there. Well, it was a better challenge than a drunk, at least. When you take a hit, swing your head around so you don't eat another big punch. Mm. Swinging my head, like bobbing and weaving? Okay, I'll remember that. You've learned damage weaving. Press uh, left bumper A when hit by an enemy. Attack to perform a weaving move and dodge out of the way. That's some good advice, uh, Kamoji. I'll put it to use. <laughs> About the winnings, we split the 100,000 entry fee, so I give you back your stake. That means 150,000 yen for you. Until next time, then. Uh. Alright, let's do this. Listen up, y'all. The punch out artist is taking challengers. Million, y million yen a shot. Best part is, you knock him down even once during the minute. Your money comes back double. Right this way, if, uh, if you got what it takes. 
Oh no, it's a big guy. A million yen, you say? All I have to do is knock this guy down once be before a minute goes by? Yep, double your cash with a single knockdown. Just pay the entry fee up front. I'm bursting at the seams with protection money at the moment. So, why not? Give me a shot at this punk. Hello. You sure you want to gamble with your family's money? If you lose, you'll end up in the creek. No chance! I've done a little boxing. No street punk's gonna dodge my punches. You sound confident. Good luck to you. This is the longest night in Camarocho. Like, holy hell, when is day gonna come? Oh, he is fast too. I'm just gonna stay over here. Oh boy. Ah, uh, you know what? I'm gonna stay over here. Ah, uh, this place is tacky. I'm gonna go over here. Mm, but these people seem pretty fine. Hmm. Hello, ladies. Ow. Gentlemen. Hello, my fellow dudes. Ladies. Ladies. L sir. Ladies. Mm, older gentlemen. Ow. Come on, take a swing. Take a swing. Come on. You're nothing. You're nothing. Ah! <laughs> this is why I shouldn't open my big mouth. <sighs> I should really just keep my big mouth shut. Uh, I got punched after insulting this guy. I, I was getting too cocky for my own good. Uh. Alright, this time for real. You stay over there. I'll stay over here. I insulted him. He assaulted me. Ow! Oh, God! That would have knocked me on my ass. The worst part was, uh, I think there was like less than 10 seconds left before I could have beaten the challenge. Ooh, God. Nope. Don't get cocky. We're almost there. Come on, come on. There we go. Damn, you're hard to pin down. All my earnings, gone. At least he's in a good mood about it. Thanks for trying. Help you figure out the way, a way to pay your boss. If he lets you live, come back and try again. <laughs> Good work, Kiryu-san. The guy sure packed the punch, didn't he? Uh. Yeah, I wasn't sure about that one. When you can't evade and your guard is broken, you got to stay calm and put your guard put up your guard again. Then you'll be protected. Mm. Put my, up my guard again, huh? The floating regard one. Press the left bumper after your guard is broken to move away and put up your guard again. <laughs> Alright, only two more moves, but uh. I don't think we can get it yet. Got the money. Oh, nope, we can. 
Oh, and I feel like the next one's either going to be 50 million or 100 million. That'll buy you a new car. No takers. Yes, there's not many around who'd stake 10 million on a street fight. Maybe not. Hey, you guys. Aha! A bite! You swap between... Uh, you swap between Saiyan San and Kun in their dialogue. I notice... Am I going full weeb or not? <laughs> I, I'm just reading what's on the... On, in the dialogue box, Dragon. But yes, I'm going full weeb. You two set the, set the stakes pretty high. And that confident you can win? Confident as can be. You looks, uh, looking to take up the gauntlet. It'll cost you 10 million yen up front. Is it okay if I use a katana instead of my fists? Huh? Uh, sure, why not? Hey! You'll be fine, Kiri-san. We'll never get another nibble at 10 million. If I get cut to shreds, I'm blaming you. Okay, is this alright if I try it on, out on this guy, Kabusan? Be my guest. I'll chop him in too. No trouble. I've been looking forward... I've been looking for a place to test this blade out, you see. What's the deal with the katana? Kabusan here deals in antiques. He says this is a historical katana, an enriched blade, said to strike down even the wiliest ninja master on the spot. An enchanted blade? If it's real, it'll be a national treasure, a bargain at several hundred million yen. Ten million is a fair price for tr uh, testing it out. Uh, I'm getting a bad feeling about this, Kiryu. <laughs> you think? Let's see if I can dodge that thing. Well, I'll be needing that entry fee then. Let me go over the rules. Kiryu, don't die! I got faith in you, Kiryu. Alrighty, let's fight! Uh. Uh. Ooh. Oh, that is an actual blade. It's not one of those wooden katanas that usual Yakuza swing around. No, he is actually trying to kill me! He literally just tried to run me through with that thing! Uh, excuse me, I was doing my bob and weave there for a second. Oh, wait! Come on, take a swing. Do it! Oh, no! Oh, no! Yeah, I didn't mean you to literally do it! How's he not hitting the crowd? Uh, very, very carefully. I was hoping the sword would slice him in two. I'm still not really convinced. Mind if I mold over a bit more? Just talk smack again and got stabbed. I really need to learn to just stop talking smack to these guys, because they're going to smack me. When you go up against the katana, I it doesn't matter if it's enchanted or not, you dodge or you get cut in half. I hate the fact that we are also down to, like, the last 10 seconds. Uh. It's that guy with the katana again. He doesn't look too happy. I'm still not convinced. Is it okay if I test it out again? Uh, no problem. Try it as many times as you like. Literally kill this guy. Alright. That thrust attack will knock me, uh, knock me down in one hit, so I really need to be careful with it. It seems like the, the slice attacks, uh, I think if he gets like a three-hit combo, that's gonna knock me down. 
I was bobbing! Well, no wonder it couldn't slice me in half. You thrusted it into me instead of slicing. You can evade during the motion leading into an LB guard stance. Press the button at the right time to evade enemy attacks. I need to avoid that stab attack, Shank. Uh. All right, let's try this again. I'm still not convinced. Here, let me try and kill this man again. Alright. New strategy. Stay the hell away from him. Oh no, he stabbed that man! Oh yeah, my, my quick steps actually give me heat because I think that's something I uh, got, uh, I unlocked. And you're nothing! You're nothing! Speaking of stabbing, I don't know if you watched my Among Us VOD, but when I was an imposter, specifically looking for you for punning me. For out punning me? <laughs> wow, you were out for blood, weren't you? I couldn't cut him down. Is this blaze is this blade really enchanted? Let's talk about this, Kabasan. I don't think this is gonna work out. B but so your name's Kiryu, huh? Well, thanks to you, I just lost out on a big payday. You're blaming me for your shady business deal going bust? Get a life. Tch! You'll get yours! Was that really an enchanted katana, Kiryu? No. In fact, it had mostly lost its edge. It was probably just trying to get a better price for that junk. I had a feeling. Who can afford to slap down 10 million like that anyway? Must have his priorities all wrong. Maybe. Just shows that we're not... That we're not likely to get any takers for a 100 million yen course. Yeah. Oh well. I got to tell you something. What's that? When you're in a pinch and can't get away, shoving the enemy is another option. Then you move around behind them. Shove them, huh? Counter quit step. It's like you evade and switch places with the enemy. Hold the right bumper to enter a fighting stance, then press B in time with the enemy's attack. <clears throat> About the winnings. Uh, split the 10 million again. Go by your stake. Make 15 million. So we lost 5 million on that one. For overhead and lesson fees, I think I'll give you some pretty good advice. Fine, I guess it helped build my skills, so I won't complain. Yeah, that's never gonna happen. We're not gonna get any takers, Kamoji. Uh. Got some money. And using tip top shape, are you drum up business? Yes. Hi. Okay, who will take on a notorious punch out artist? My star apprentice, Kiryu san, is looking for challengers. A hundred million yen a shot! You get double the money back if you knock him down once in a minute. That's way better odds than winning the lottery. 
All we can do, all we can do is try to dodge. Who wants to get in on this dream match? Hey, you two. Ah, do we have a challenger? I didn't expect to find one so easy. Y you realize the prize money's got to be paid in advance, right? Whoa, calm down. He doesn't pay out prize money. I have 100 million yen right here. This should cover the entry fee, right? B perfect I hear you went up against a guy wearing a katana. You okay uh, with me using a weapon too? It's nothing big as that old sword. Uh, I guess that sounds okay. R right, Kiryu? Sure. <laughs> he pulls out a gun. Then we have a deal. Go over the rules, don't get hit. Seems normal enough, eh, Kiryu? Guess when the stakes go up to 100 million, you can weed out the dodgy types. <sighs> I hope you're right. Why the long face? Come on, let's fight. I swear, if he does pull out a gun... He's got a gun! Why does he have a gun? And how is he not... Oh, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him. Damn, still alive. Whoa there, mister! A gun's taking things a bit too far. Close, but no cigar. If you want me dead, put together another 100 million again and try again. I'll take you on any time. Kiryu! I know you can hear me. I'm talking to you. Huh? You knew? Hey. It's the guy who was fixing to sell that sword. I lost a lot of money thanks to you. How are you going to make this right? That's why you sent a guy at me with a gun? Too bad it didn't work out for you. You really get on my nerves. Fine. I'll just have to take care of you myself. What are you waiting for then? I spent enough time dancing around. Punching someone would be great right now. Kiryu. Don't try to stop me, Kom uh, Komoji. This guy's got it coming. Wasn't going to. I hope you give him his just dessert. Now, you can put all you've learned to the test. Ready? Huh? To completely pulverize the enemy, you got to evade all their attacks real smooth like. Dance out of their way, then smash your face in to your heart's content. Anyone not a customer gets no mercy from me. Kimoji. You've learned the essence of relentless barrage. Exploit a gap in the enemy's defense and unleash a combo attack. This technical move also incorporates uh, uh, feints press Y near a frightened enemy. Got it. Just you watch. You're a good teacher, Komoji. I'm glad you made me your apprentice, but I'm afraid I have to call it quits on the punch-out game after this. Get Kiryu-san. Let's see if you can punch me out before I flatten you. Okay, thankfully I don't have to deal with the guy with the gun anymore. Uh, d hold on a second. I need to check something real quick and rush. Essence of Iron Fist. Essence of Sword Shattering. Heat Wave. Heat Retention. Essence of Crushing Wall. Retention, heat wave, and ah, uh, there it is. That's the one I wanted. Oh well, I can still do crushing wall at least. Hopefully. No, oh, there goes that guy. Oh, I killed him. He is dead. Jeez.
Uh, Rush is not good for multiple opponents. Especially ones that love to guard so much. These guys are annoying. Ah, damn it. Are you stuck in rush? Yeah. Like, I tried to swap over to Brawler, and I couldn't do it. Guys would stop guarding all the time. Jeez, get, stay down. I would love to get a heat move off on these guys. Unfortunately, Rush is not... Oh, wait, there was... Ah, oh, damn it. Almost got it. There we go. It's not give you a lot of time to get that heat move off. Get out of here! Jeez, that was annoying. Guess things didn't work out like you hoped. Don't show your face here anymore. If I lay eyes on you again, you won't get off so easy. Got it.
I'm done with the punch out artist business now, Kamoji. Thanks for the pointers. Yeah. Hey, it should be me thanking you. Being your teacher made me a little famous around here. <laughs> well, there's nothing special about me. I'm more impressed by how long you stuck with this gig. Hitting folks is scary, but getting hit doesn't bother me at all. That's why this suits me perfect. Gotta enjoy your job or it never lasts. Uh. You're probably right. Oh, yeah. Let me pay you back your winnings. Here's the 100 million that you staked for the 100 million yen you won. That's 200 million. Huh? I thought we were doing an even split. What about your cut? No use carrying that kind of cash for a guy like me. A man who gets rich overnight just finds trouble. But with 50 million yen, you could leave the streets behind and live a normal life. I'm planning on getting an apartment with some of the cash I made up. Uh, I made up to last time. I won't be homeless anymore. Even a shabby old apartment would be a place for me. That's all I could ask for, or be a palace. I see. I owe you big time, Kiryu-san. I'll be sticking to the punch out artist gig. Come see me when you get the time. Okay. Alright, that's everything for Rush. Uh, for the Rush training, at least. And I see that our mushroom dealer is back. You know, uh, you know what? I'm an idiot. I forgot I still had the mushrooms to eat. I could have eaten those during the fight. Ooh, million. What I get, what I get, what I get. Super alloy bat. Oi. This is just a plain old shiitake mushroom. You got a death wish, punk? N no, of course not. That's Kitajima, the shroomer. Hurry up and hand over the shrooms. We gotta get this train rolling. You screw us over, or we'll have to teach you a lesson. L look, like I said before, I only sell regular mushrooms. Uh -huh. What? You expect us to believe you're here in the middle of Camarocho selling nothing but table mushrooms? Uh... Looks like you got himself into a mess here. Not that I'm surprised. Oi. Kiryu? Huh? What's your beef? This guy's really just a regular mushroom seller. If you want the other kind of mushroom, better try elsewhere. Oi. And who asked for your opinion, huh? You got some nerve button in like that. They're gonna regret disrespecting the boss. We just want to trip out on shrooms. You're gonna be a real sorry if uh, if you get in our way. That's so. If it's a trip you want, I got a one-way ticket to pound. <laughs> Kiryu, you're such a dork! I swear. His smile. He knows what he said, and he's proud of it. Cocky fucker! They're going down! Oh. Uh, that, that, that was the guy. I thought that was his, uh, this guy's friend over there. <laughs> I want to see if I can get that uh, heat move out. Oh, there goes your friend! And there goes your face. Ugh, this guy's a monster. Let's regroup, boss. You'll get what's coming to you. Thanks for helping me out again, Kiryu. That was pretty dicey. Yeah, I guess people still haven't gotten the message that I'm just selling regular mushrooms. Mm. You couldn't have picked the worst place to sell them. Here, you just really hate that trash, huh? Oh, and that pile of garbage, too. Oh, and those trash bags. <laughs> well, you have a point, but I don't think that's the only problem. You don't? Pretty much every day, someone comes here with the wrong idea. There's got to be some other reason. The reason he gets mistaken for an illicit shroom dealer? Maybe it's the way you talk. Maybe it's the way you talk is a problem. 
The way I talk? Yeah, that's it. You sound shady as hell. Just the type who'd be selling dangerous mushrooms. Huh? You mumble a lot. And the way your sentences trail off doesn't help either. You have to be more cheerful in the service industry. But this is just how I talk. Well, first you need to practice. Try being more cheerful when you speak. I've got good mushrooms. I've got good mushrooms. Like that. Not even close! Aww. You need to put more effort into it. Project your voice. A smile is important too. I should know. I'm the master at smiling. Don't you see the smile on my face right now? I'm absolutely beaming! Wow, he he keeps... The more I look at Kiryu, the more pissed off he looks. Once again, Kiryu has rusting grump face. The finest mushrooms, fresh today. My mushrooms are truly superb. <laughs> Much better. You still have a ways to go, but you're on the right track. The smile looks more natural, and it's a big improvement over your first attempt. You really think so? I can't tell the difference. I do. I bet fewer people will mistake you for a shady mushroom dealer now. I hope so. Thank you, Kiryu-san. You might want to change your laugh, too. Oh, Kiryu. In the market for some marvelous mushrooms? Eh, give me some shiitakes. <laughs> Customer skill, uh, service skills are really improving. Come again. Remember, for magnificent mushrooms, Kachima is your man. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Just keep giving me the shrooms. And he's off. He's speaking up a lot better now. All right. Uh, let's take a cab back to the office after I beat these guys to a bloody pulp. I see a bicycle. I want it. Plant? Plant! Pl Excuse me! Plant! Now, as I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted, let's head back to the office and get our payment. We get our payment, uh, take a small break because we have been going on for quite a bit, and then when we get back we'll do COCOMs. You know what? The hell with it. Let's see what we get. Gold champagne. Honey, I'm home. Oh, and Marina, you're here too. All right, we have enough to buy one property.
I am... I really need to get more security, because holy hell. Put you there. Pleasure. Put you there. Let's start investing here. Akio, where is Miracle? There you are. Alright, that's almost an S rank. That's got some work going into it. Marusa. Miracle. Remember when I was scared to spend over a billion yen when it came to uh, investments, and now it's just like, you know what? Spend all the money. That's good. And that needs... That needs a miracle. Alright, there we go. Got that. Let's invest in this with Mama. Get the collecting, you get the collecting there. And while we wait on that, let's go to intermission, shall we? <clears throat> Alright, so, gonna go take a small break. When we get back, we will continue, uh, probably get the next, uh, set of money, invest some more. Do some more side stories, and maybe also go to the dock and get some beast training done. Alright. I will see you all in just a little bit.
Okay, and I'm back. And I got the window open for CoCom, so everybody is welcome to join. And of course, as soon as I come back, we're dropping frames. Only 60 though, so it's not that bad. This is what happens when I open my big mouth, I swear. Alright, let's get back to the game. Hey. Alright, shit. Hey, how's it going? I had to ban my first dickhead in chat tonight. <laughs> I had that ban a dickhead in chat tonight for the first time. Oh dear, what happened? So, I was doing a combat challenge in the movie game, and, uh... This guy came in saying, Can I lick your balls? What? Yeah. I did the message saying not to do that. He then asked if I wanted to play Fortnite. I said, no, it's not my type of game. And then he... Well, there's your first... There's your red flag. They said you want to play Fortnite. Yeah, no, no, no. I look away for a few seconds to focus on the game. I look back. He's he's talking about SpongeBob being a pedo. What? Yeah, I'm like, okay, no, this dude's getting out of here. I'm I'm probably gonna have to watch that vod now just to get the full context of everything. Yeah, it feels like I just got taken out of this reality. <laughs> His messages are still in the chat on the vod screen. Oh god. I don't know Hi Moon! There. Uh, Hi Moon. What, what the fuck did I <laughs> Uh, madness. When isn't there madness? Uh, are you in um, Wonderland? Uh, let's see, uh, what, what day is it? Oh wait, it's not, it's... Wednesday, not Friday. <laughs> I'm so thrown off because we're playing Yakuza, not on a Friday. Dude, it feels like Thursday. Uh, also, tomorrow, speaking of Thursday, no. <clears throat> no, I refuse to believe it. That's the forecast says a, rain, a mixture of rain and snow. Well, the forecast has been wrong before. It can be wrong again. <sighs> you don't know it. You're not a weatherman. <laughs> what have I told you I am? You're not my dad. I, I'd be like, I don't believe you. And you read not to believe me because I'm fucking with you. <laughs> I don't believe someone who wears a cheese hat, A, and B, made it a point that uh, Among Us Knight to go out and kill me because I outpunned yes. him. Yes! I'm that petty. Mm, mm. To be fair, I did throw you under the bus at one time, so. I'm surprised that uh, the Shinobi did not see me kill you with an admin. I'm surprised no one else didn't see me uh, see you kill me an admin. I just killed you and dug to the vet, then I noticed Shinobi was like, ah, shit. <laughs> but no, he walked off and then Amaris came in and I was like, wait, wait, did he not? <laughs> <laughs> I, I just kept quiet during I... the call once Moon started accusing Amaris. I, I pretend not to see. All right, let's go get some shrooms. Uh, what kind of shrooms? Uh, well, we got shiitake, we got Edo. Oh yeah. We got the good kind, the kind that can put a smile on your face. <laughs> uh, apparently, uh, from so sometimes people ask for fried mushrooms at work, so I guess we sold those at one point. I I don't remember. Uh, here in DQ, selling mushrooms. Maybe like I'm, the only thing I, I mean, if you go up, back like at some for a burger. Wait, I gotta say, we have our patio open now, and people can come in and order again. And it's super weird seeing people inside the building. Yeah, because it's been a, a year and a half, <laughs> almost two years. <sighs> oh great! Hold on, I need to spend a million or ten thousand. Oh, he's got three people on his ass this time. Oh, it's stamina. That was actually pretty good. Huh? These are just mataki mushrooms. What are you trying to pull? I don't sell any illicit mushrooms here. Say what? You gotta be kidding! Hand over the good mushrooms, quick! You're gonna pull the good mushrooms he sells. 
If you want to stay in one piece, you better get the real stuff before we get annoyed. But, like I said, I only sell regular mushrooms. Huh? Think we're gonna believe you set up shop in the middle of Camarocho selling plain old mushrooms? Ugh. Looks like I'm gonna get dragged into this mess again. You came down this alleyway again, Kira, you? Hey. Who the frick are you? I'm Kiryu. Who the guy is just a regular mushroom seller. If you're looking for the other kind of mushroom, try somewhere else. Where do you get off talking to us like that? Get out of the way, man. You get out of the way. You're obstructing his business. What is that guy's suit pattern? Words. Uh, the guy in green. L literally words. This guy strived there. One's checkered. This guy's just this guy's just Wikipedia. <laughs> All right, come on, take a swing, take a swing, take a swing. Give me that knife. Where did that knife go? Oh, I guess he just loses the weapon. I thought I could disarm him and take it. Oh, wait. Is that it? No, that is an ashtray. Well, we better cremate him then and add it to him. Oh, wait. There's a knife. Oh, no, wait. That's just a pocket knife, not the little sword thing. All right, come on. Come on. All right, fine. I'll just kick him while he's down. I really want to get that new uh, heat, rush heat move that we got for doing the the training, but I can only do that when a guy is scared. Well, don't scare him out of their wits. <laughs> uh, here's the thing: I don't know what scares them. I I think like a brutal attack, like a brutal heat move, does the trick, and I think it's only uh, for like meek enemies. No, you just I say booed them. Kiryu, thanks for saving me again. They're in a bit of a bind. I get the feeling that there are still too many people who don't realize I'm just a regular mushroom seller. You think? Yeah, you've gotten a lot friendlier, but the spot is a terrible place to sell mushrooms. Well, that may be true, but I'm sure there's more room for improvement. Room for improvement? I don't want to blame it all on the location. If there are still things I can try, I, I can, I'm going to stick with it. You're in the back Let's of an see. alleyway. Need to do to stop people from thinking he sells, halluc sells hallucinogenic mushrooms. I don't know, maybe set up an actual stand? Uh, a mascot, a theme song, or image training. Mm, mascot! I mean, hey, I got one. <laughs> How about you design a mascot? A mascot? A person or character that represents your product. They're always used using that kind of thing in advertising. Yeah, you're right. But who's going to be the mascot? Good point. It intensely stares at Kiryu. Oh, no. <laughs> Kiryu with a mushroom head. Uh, nope. He just suggested uh, he be the mascot himself. Uh, I don't think I've so. I've never seen okay, Kiryu then. that... Uh... Freaking, what's the word? Egotistical. <laughs> I I thought I'd make a good mascot, but he didn't agree. There must be something else he can do, though. How about a theme song? How about you come up with a theme song? Theme song? A jingle that makes your product more memorable. You hear them on TV and radio. Well, sure, those catchy tunes do get stuck in my head all the time. But how would I put my theme song out there? I don't have the money for advertising. Just saying it here all day long. Cure you. What? I can't do that. Especially seeing as how it's nighttime. You said you'd be willing to try anything, right? At least see how it goes. Uh, but I don't have a song to sing. Mm, you need something light and catchy to get uh, rid of your shitty image. How about this? Immediately you start singing Bakumatai. <laughs> Okay, now give it a try. <clears throat> Here it goes. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. Mirac mushrooms. Miraculous mushrooms, marvelous mushrooms, Inoki shiitake. 
Paparucci for Magnificent Mushrooms, your man is Kajima. <laughs> Not bad at all. The lyrics work well, if I do say so myself. You think? So we need to quickly make that goal so so uh, DBG is seeing those songs live. Uh. <laughs> also add the mushroom jingle to it then? Yes. Yeah, nobody would mistake you for a hallucinogenic mushroom dealer singing in that song. <laughs> now that you mention it, I think you're right. Okay, I'll give Sinan a try. Thanks, Kiryu. He needs a, he just needs a sign saying, I do not sell hallucinogens. I don't know, he's seeing the song. Give me the shiitakes. Give them shoes, boy. <laughs> Kiryu's making grabby hands. Uh. Mm, mushrooms. <laughs> To be fair, I actually hate mushrooms. The, the texture of them just tastes weird. Uh, I don't like them either. Uh. Moon? Mm -hmm. Mushroom or no? Do you shroom or not to shroom? I, I hate mushrooms. So all agreeance. Mushrooms suck ass. <laughs> yes. Alright, well, now that he's marching away... Ah, oh, great. There's trouble brewing. Hang on, I gotta go beat people up. <laughs> Again? <laughs> yep, these are... Oh, uh, let's see, Media King agents. Oh, makes sense they'd be in suits with sunglasses. At night, the assholes. Hey, they wear their sunglasses at night so they can see. I forget how that song goes aside from like the, the like the chorus. I guess like, given how we've we've established Media King, how do I know these guys have the actual mushrooms? Hmm. Okay, he, okay, here's Come a question speaking of food. You guys ever heard of frickles? What? No cursing on my stream. Have you ever heard of Frickles Moon? Fried pickles. I... They just say fried pickles. Here we say frickles. Because that's that, that's what a uh, a place where my sister and my dad get them. Yeah, uh, fat heads. They call them frickles there. Gross. <laughs> you know saying. You know mozzarella sticks are just like fried uh, sticks, of, sticks of mozzarella cheese, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. At Cedar Point, they literally just sell fried cheese on a stick, like a corn dog. Ugh, God. It's good, though. It's actually, it's actually pretty good. I don't care. It sounds like hatred. It's good. <laughs> Next time you're at Cedar it's, Point, try it. It's the uh, there's actually a, a local fair that comes by every year, and I know there's a, a stand that sells fried cheese on a stick. Then get it. It's good. Uh, no, I would like to my, I would like my insides to stay, you know, in one piece. <laughs> they actually don't destroy what your the insides. Hell did I get? It's it's just it's just like fry batter of cheese on the inside. That's it. Secret stash binding. Binding contains a hidden wall, allowing you to limit the losses uh, when people try to shake you down. God, I'm thinking of fried food. We have a we have a thing to make funnel cake downstairs. We have not used it yet, and that's disappointing. Oh, that sounds so good <laughs> right about now. Why is it when I bring up work, I start bringing up more food, and it just makes us hungry? <laughs> it's a good thing I ate before stream, but still, that sounds really good. <laughs> we had uh, orange ruffy for dinner tonight with rice. Ooh. You ask mom on the plans for today and tomorrow's uh, weather? No. Yeah, I don't get what it I don't get no. <laughs> I don't get what it means, but I got the, her answer. Oh, very good. First, what's mom on say about the plans for today? Uh a party in my pants. <laughs> I think did somebody say party in the pants? Oh god. Oh, no. 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 It's not it's not the same without Tamo. Moon's just going to her corner. It, it, uh how about a movie date? She said a movie date. Okay, movie date, got it. Okay, how about tomorrow's weather? Uh, I believe it was rain at noon. 
Remember when we could go out to, to a movie theater? Good times. I mean, they're slowly starting to come back. <sighs> slowly. I just want to very slowly. I just want to see Sonic Two in theaters like I did Sonic One of Friends. Well, I mean, we still got another year, <laughs> or I think uh, until uh, Christmas. Okay, good work. You bring me Mama and Sansa, big uh, help. Thank for the, sure. Thankfully for me, I am fully vaccinated. I'm getting my shot. I'm. I'm... You, Moon, little uh, thing here. Take some painkillers before you go because your arm is going to be sore. I'll take. Yeah, I heard it. Like it, it takes a lot out of your arm after you get the shot. Well, I'm. <laughs> I'm doing the shot on the weekend, so that way I'm not having to do anything. Yeah, but but still, I'd, say, I'd still recommend taking some painkillers because I did the weekend too. But my arm was still sore afterwards. Tell me anything about a fight to get mom on to talk, though. It would have been good to know. Hmm, all part of the job, and that's why I asked you in the first place. Okay, TV You're quite useful, man. I'm impressed. TBG, I found out something in 3D World. Uh -huh. There is a rolling long jump that gets you more distance than a normal long jump. Oh, yeah, I know about those. I didn't even know about that until I accidentally did it while doing uh, my playthrough on my save file. By the way, what was this about? What do you need, Maman, about our plans for today and tomorrow's weather? I think I'll tell you, no chance. Code words are, are for next business deal. <laughs> so it was just for some shady deal after all. I figured those phrases shouldn't be taken at face value. Okay. Okay, I'm all done with your job. Hurry up and give me the password. Give yeah, well, it's been a Patience. while. What is exactly next in Kiryu's mainline story? Uh, we still have to go to Sotenbori to get Makoto. Because Tachibana and Oda figured out that's where she was. Even though, if you remember what happened in, in the Anamajima story half a year back, uh, things kind of didn't go the way that it, it was planned. And Lee kind of, you know, got killed in a car bomb. Good lord. And we couldn't finish right. the cabaret. Well, whenever we get back to Majima, we're going to do the cabaret. If we get back Next to Majima. Soon, but... If. That is true. Okay, fine. No, we go to Sotenbori, Kiryu manages the cabaret. Oh, my lord, and that's suit as well. Leilun, you're back. How did your deal go? The business deal went through thanks to you. Thank you. Uh, a broken M19? Is, is that a... Is that a pistol or is that a rifle? That's a shotgun. Is your gilded shotgun though? No. Damn. <laughs> no, that's literally uh, an American-made shotgun. It's just pump action. It's, I think it was the one that one guy pulled on us when we were. Uh, I. I forget when we were fighting a guy and he pulled a shotgun on me. Pump action, like Bentley's crossbow. God, <laughs> that still bothers me. I know it's just because they changed uh, his crossbow uh, from a, from a, like a, a laser rifle, but still. <laughs> By the way, about the password. I know, and don't forget, I'll tell you. Listen carefully, okay? Sure, I'm listening. Password is... Important to capitalize the letter first. Huh? What's the problem? You see what I mean when I tell you the, uh, when you tell the merchant man. Put that, uh, put that yeah, in a new password you? maker, and it'll still say it's weak. <laughs> you have to, you have to add an exclamation point at the end. I fucking hate sites that do that. Oh, you have to have two, you have to have a capitalization, a number, eh, and a punctuation. It's like, fuck off. And also, it needs to be at least eight letters long. Seriously, I hate all those stupid requirements at times. It's like, that's, I have so many variations of the same password because of it. Can you say it one more time? See, you listen carefully, okay? I'll be nice. One more time. I say the password. I write it down, TVG. So Memorize? You say the password to the merchant. Skip it a bop a bop a bop a bop. Skip it a bop 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 bop. Bop 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 bop. Bum, 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 bum. <laughs> I 
swear, it's gonna be for something really mundane. I, I think I think Yakuza is officially making us insane now. I'll if last week was anything to go by. <laughs> I wanna buy. Say the password. Oh, now that I'm thinking about it, I, should, I don't know why, I just popped my head. I should probably right. down my other two uh VODs for Italian Wars. Ah. Password. Alright. Oh no, I actually have to type it in! Yeah, that's why I said write it down. <laughs> Uh, skip it a bop and bop up. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, so I'm just going to look up what the password is so I can type it in correctly. Good lord, TVG. Uh, uh let's see, uh, uh, it's, uh, sub to TVG. Got it. God, our last, uh, our last, this, uh, 3D world of VOD is, for me, is expiring four days. Jeez. It's like, I'm not affiliated, so my stuff expires more quickly, and it sucks. Better get those three people, then. I'm trying. So, pretend you... H, I... G, E. I should just send this one video. I'm thinking about it into the memes. I'm not even gonna try to pronounce that. Let's skip it a bop and bop it. Hmm. Good. That's it. Sweet, I got- What is this little victory music that's playing? It's, it's like Kiryu won the Olympics. The, 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 now he runs off into, into the distance, jumps, puts his fist in the air, and, and, and the whole thing freezes. This animation's an old one, but it's a good one. Yeah, finally managed to get the password right on the first try. Didn't expect it to become- uh, I didn't expect it to become a go-between for a shitty deal- to have to get it, but it turned out all right. That was a lot of work to satisfy my curiosity. Hmm. Now, what am I forgetting? Hey, are you buying anything? Oh. Maybe later. <laughs> Kiryu, you, you dumbass! We went through all that and it's just like, hey, uh, here's the password. All right, satisfy my curiosity. Eh, maybe later. All right, what do we want? Ooh, ooh, ooh! <laughs> Side stabilizer, high torque motor, spike back, nameless katana. You sound like you sound like Beetle. Oh! <laughs> oh my God! Uh, Thank get a you. Modified deluxe slider. Thank you. <laughs> Get ourselves a katana. Get ourselves some stuff for the pocket circuit. My file's not open. All right. All right. Uh, let's see. Still can't. I think we need to go into a building, so I might as well go get some barbecue. Because I think, yeah, we actually are less than half health. I really should get some barbecue. Kiryu, rushing out to get that barbecue. I, gee, I wonder where we're gonna have to go meet the Disco King. Or the Media King. He could be anywhere! Joke's on you, it's the movie lot. <laughs> no, imagine you had to meet him at a, uh... At a, just a regular old restaurant. I, I, I just meet him in the park where all, where all the homeless people stay. <laughs> We're next to Bob. Hi. Not I can't do it. Not that Bob. Hi. Hi. No, I can't do it either. You know that almost you almost actually did it, so I instinctively looked over at the chat <laughs> to see, oh, is Tano here? <laughs> Was she surprising us with Bob? <laughs> you know she would. Speaking of Bob. Oh, I know. 
Also, speaking of Bob, I probably should pay a visit to the temple because we do have a <laughs> lot of CP. You gotta get another fish but gun. I, would... I got. Oh, I got twenty-one. We could. Uh, how far is it? Oh, it's quite a ways. Time to hoof uh, it. I'll hold off on it. <gasps> now, nah, hold off on it for a bit. But I do need to step away for a moment. I'll be right back. Take your time. He comes back. So the police are after me. Uh. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> we just hear sirens in the background. <laughs> but but yeah, no. I, mean, what I was talking about earlier regarding SpongeBob. I just had a dickhead in chat earlier. Yeah. It's like my first chatter for the stream tonight, and he says, "Can I lick your balls?" <laughs> And I'm like, what the? I, I, it baffles me why people do that sort of stuff. To just go into a chat and be a dick. Ugh, Shema. I just don't understand people these days. Neither do I. We're in the middle of a pandemic, and yet we get a Russian Dairy Queen. Well, I mean, they are trying to probably reopen all the states now. <laughs> I don't understand why. I would rather wait until we have a lot of people who are vaccinated. Mm. I mean, people gotta make money. Mm. Yeah. Oh, excuse me. You good? Mm hmm. Hiccup. <laughs> Every time I drink soda, at least once I'll hiccup. I don't have anything else to drink. I just have water. <laughs> and I was kind of hoping there'd be some more soda upstairs, but no. Mm. Here are my files not opening. I just want to throw my Battalion Wars VODs into the folder. Tired? Ugh, yeah. <laughs> Long day. <laughs> hey, j just be glad you, you didn't have uh, oil spray on you for filtering a fryer. Just be glad you didn't get nasty, dirty, bloody bus money today. What? Yeah. <laughs> I mean, how to change the fryer filters? That's pretty disgusting. <laughs> bunch of, bunch of uh, like fried fried crumbs that once I got burnt the bottom, I gotta like scoop it out for dustpan. Honestly, I think I'd rather deal with a nasty fryer than half the fucking money I have to touch. <laughs> <clears throat> it is a wonder you haven't gotten COVID yet. N me. <laughs> Yeah. Well, consider you're, you're handling money all day and different people have touched it. Yeah. It's... I mean, we have, like, contaminated money, but it's not in the open. Like, you have to send it to the Fed. So, they'll burn it. <laughs> Wait, hang on. You know, my, my files are just not opening. I'll have to restart my computer later tomorrow. I have both the VODs downloaded, so you're good to go. So I'm, I just gotta splice the second one together since I, it's in two parts. <laughs> there you go. Have fun reading that. Oh, <laughs> uh, Lord, okay. Oh, God. What is with people? Every year, I swear there's more and more stupid people. 
Oh, this was before COVID. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like I feel, I feel like once the the pandemic happened, it just amplified it for some reason. Mm. And the back. We've uh. <sighs> so so what got amplified? Super people due to pandemic. Oh yeah. <laughs> But if there's this goes city boy. If there's one thing that one did good that did happen, uh, people are calling uh, Karens out more and more. Good. Also, guess what? We're gonna buy the most expensive place in in Camarocho. Do it. Jesus. We. Yes. Oh, he didn't pull. Okay, but see, he doesn't pull the briefcase. That actually is actually a pretty good capture of it. I think I I can use that for the. Would alert. The At least until I get the animation for it done. The, sm or commissioned. the smug look he has at the end of it. Well, yeah, he just paid a billion yen to buy the most expensive property in Camera Road. You got a rare you would be achievement smug about for that. <laughs> Good. You know, I had to pay to get that achievement. <laughs> oh, you're playing this through Game Pass, aren't you? Yes. Huh. What? All the Yakuza games are on Game Pass. Oh, good lord. Well, all but two. A mafia three, boss, no, geez. Four. Wait, isn't Yakuza just a uh, Japanese mafia? Yes. But this is Mafia Mafia. Do they beat up small it's, uh, hat child? It's a uh, Bunashimji. Uh, Buna what? That's not the mushroom we want. T sorry. You may have gotten the wrong idea, but we only sell regular mushrooms here. Huh? Give me shrooms! <laughs> wow. I don't think this guy is Japanese. Uh. Holy mother of forehead. You could screen a movie on that thing. <laughs> I came a long way because I heard you had quality shrooms. What gives? Who's selling this well, information? Our mushrooms are the, are the finest quality, but they're just mushrooms with no special properties. Oh. It's no use. He doesn't understand. What am I going to do? Oh, I know. Miraculous mushrooms, oh, marvelous oh, mushrooms, God. Noki shiitake, porochi, for magnificent mushrooms, your man is Kaijima. Uh. <laughs> I'm just going to leave it on this for now. That should just be a gif. <laughs> mm. Yes. Mm. Yes, mushrooms. Mm. Shrooms. Did you say shiitake? <laughs> shrooms! <laughs> mm. Shiitake. You're dead. Got. Uh, here we go again. Mm -hmm. Oh, Kiryu. You. you! How do you get this guy to cough up the good stuff? He's just a regular mushroom seller. If you want the other stuff, you know what you know the drill already. It's too late for talk. We can't back down now, even though we could. Yeah, but yes you can. He just told you he just sells regular mushrooms. Get the fuck out of there, you got wrong info. <laughs> you I'm gonna have to ask you to leave before I remove you myself. See, I'm th this guy's security, and you're harassing my employer. Basically, and your payment is this. kill him. Your payment is out of your wallet too. Oh, I'm not even beating up the main boss. It's just his goons. All right, uh, hold on a second. Oh, but you could leave such I think a dent I got in that something forehead. for this. I think I got some. Ow! Ow! My my butt. <laughs> I, I got something for this situation. Gun. It's the crazed butt stabber. <laughs> what the? Oh, that's a shock baton. <laughs> Please tell me you guys got that reference. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it sounds like Moon did. <laughs> Time to take out the trash uh, because I'm the trash man. <laughs> <laughs> you see, I take trash and I throw it all over these goons. <laughs> oh my god. Wilford Warfstash here playing in Yakuza Zero. <laughs> oh, I can't do it with the. 
Uh, it's only with uh, knives, uh, really? All right, fine. Oh god, that's just a uh, electrical stun baton. I figured that the disarming thing would uh, be for like all one-handed weapons, but no, it's and just now Kira used the, the crazy butt stabber. <laughs> no, I just stabbed them in the face like a normal person. Uh, that's boring. Wiped out. Be weird. Unbelievable. Thanks for helping me again, Kiryu. Looks like they thought you were selling hallucinogenic mushrooms again, huh? Uh, hey, you know I'm right here, right? What's it gonna take? I just want people to know I have the tastiest mushrooms in Japan. What? Wait, the tastiest mushrooms in Japan? Hey, let me try one. Mm -hmm. Hmm? Oh, sure. It was an inch to his forehead. Ah. Buno, delicious! <laughs> what is this mushroom? Oh, his nose! Uh, oh, God. J just one of my mushrooms. It tastes fantastic! How did you grow them? Uh, thank you. I have my own special technique. It's called weed. <laughs> the mushroom uh, reminded me of the old days in, in Nepal. I used to be a chef there many years ago. You were a chef? I was well known in in Nepal back then. I worked every day trying to make the best pasta in all of Europe. You may recognize the name Ramsey. God, he, he took his criticisms of people's cooking way too far. I perfected the ideal al dente pasta. This man's nose is so smushed in you swear he was Michael Jackson. You wanna know who he also reminds me of? Hmm. What? Voldemort with hair. Oh my god, yes. <laughs> the problem was the sauce. I could never find mushrooms worthy of my pasta. Oh. I visited mushroom sellers every day searching for a mushroom to match my pasta. None were good enough. Never found the right mushroom. My restaurant was losing money, and my girl left me. I grew to hate pasta. <laughs> I like it. Uh, I, I was an inspiring chef. Uh, there was no mushroom good enough for my sauce. My girlfriend left me. Ouch. I, I think we might have missed a few steps somewhere. Hey, Moon, why did you lose your shit when I said crazed butt stabber? Because I knew the reference. Okay. Uh, well, <laughs> you've lost your shit at other things, too, just because they're funny. Yes. When do I, I not? I gave up and took over the family business, the mafia. I see. I never wanted to be a gangster. I always wanted to be an Italian chef. Markiplier but I finally found it. Markiplier hasn't used Welford Wharf Session in a few years, hasn't he? <laughs> mm. I finally found it. The ideal mushroom to go with my pasta. I should be able to make the finest pasta in Europe now. Kojima, would you like to come back to Italy with me? We'll take Europe by storm with the best mushroom pasta ever. What? That's all so sudden! But if I went to Europe with you, I bet I could get lots of people to try my mushrooms. Kiryu, I... I really don't know what to think, but I... don't worry about me. You need to listen to what your heart tells you. Hi. Hmm. Because yeah. shroom. Okay. shroom, 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 shroom. <laughs> shroom. Grazie! Thank you, Kajima! Still, I'm a little worried. I think my mushrooms are the best in Japan, but I don't know if people will like them overseas. Mm. Show some confidence. Remember what you you uh, remember what you always say, huh? Oh yeah. For magnificent mushrooms, Kajima is your man. Oh, and that's it. We don't get anything for it, unless. Wait, I don't remember that. What the heck is that thing? Ingrinkno, a tasty mushroom you don't see often. It was apparently named by Kaichima. It could well become a household staple in the future. Hmm. Alright. Let's head back to the office because I think collection is ready. Yep. Just gonna sneak by these guys real quick. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> You're good. 
Oh, damn you, movie. <laughs> Guys, every girl's actually make me yawn. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, I guess while we're making our way back to the office, I can talk about something I discovered this week. Uh, um, was that your IQ? To get here. All right, where's the ban button? <laughs> <Can't do it>. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I never said insinuate it was low, now did I? I just said you found it. All right, moving to the ban button right God, now. I, I didn't even insinuate you're dumb. I was just saying you found your found out what your IQ was. Up, oh, babe. I I knew it. You, you were there with the shroomer. Hmm? You're... You're the mafia boss who took uh, Kojima the shroomer to Europe. Yes, yes. Kojima and I are working together every day to create a number of mushroom pasta in all of Europe. Every day, just have it five minutes ago. Every day. <laughs> <laughs> What's Kajima up to now? He is still in Europe making mushrooms. The man's got talent. I see. Then what are you doing back in Camarocho? Well, that's the thing. Kajima has such a head for business that I've run out of things to do at work. I asked Kachima to do some, uh, for some time off to come back here, back to where it all started, Camarocho. Uh, he's your boss now? But I'm starting to get bored with playing tourist in Camarocho by myself. I'm looking for excitement. Isn't there anything exciting going on? Can't really think of anything, unless... Would you be interested in joining the secu- Oh, finally we get some new security! Security? Ah, that sounds like fun. Just what I need to get back uh, my killer instinct after making pasta all the time. Grazie. I accept your offer. I shall join your firm. <laughs> he doesn't even have a name. He's just the Mafia boss. Listen. Eh, he's actually pretty good. Oh, it's just a lump seeing little girls in hats. He'll go irate. I haven't tasted the blood of my enemies in a long time. I can't wait. Oh... You know I'm not asking for anything like that, right? Anyway, welcome aboard. Is that why he says his pasta Level... sauce has extra iron in it? <laughs> level 1 Kiryu, level 100 Mafia God boss. God damn it. <laughs> hey, I'm surprised it took us this long to make those stupid uh, uh, game app jokes. <laughs> God, I've been seeing them everywhere lately. The it's driving me the insane. The fucking ones where they say, no one can beat this. And it's just a simple pull, uh, pin pull puzzle. Well, that and also, I, from what I've seen, most of them are straight up unwinnable situations. Mmm, cocaine. Oh, God. <laughs> Give me all that cocaine. That's horrifying. Uh, cocaine? <laughs> <laughs> but cocaine <laughs> did help you this time, bud. Y you know what? Aww, you know when you keep doing cocaine? the cocaine thing, all I think about is Metalocalypse and the oh, yeah? clown guy in it. I've never seen it, so I wouldn't know. <laughs> How about you, Dragon? Do you know? I have no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to share a clip. Oh, oh no. no. Oh, you don't have to, Moon. Yep. You don't have to. Oh, yes. No. I yes. think she has to. Uh, okay. Alright, uh, who do we want to put over there? I guess we'll put... Koshimitsu? I forgot the last thing I said at TV talk about a fucking Nintendo sexual educational video. What about Nintendo sexual education? I, I forgot those were the last two videos I sent TV talk. <laughs> Hello, TBG. Hello, Dragon. <laughs> it's like Mario. It's just Mario so cartoony and over the top and just Luigi. If he tried to be any more stereotypical Italian, he'd be like, I'm making the meatball, Luigi. Or you get the Italian gibberish from uh, Mario and Luigi. On top of the dead. On top of the dead. Okay, now do the one line from Luigi, the very long one. 
Uh, God, it's been so long since I played Superstar, though. I don't remember what it was. It's not from Superstar. I think it's from uh, Dream Team. It's been about five years since I played Dream Team. Uh, the only thing Luigi related I can think of is just going wowie zowie. I don't know what he said today today. Money is flowing. Let's head back out. <laughs> I still don't have enough for a property. <laughs> what? I don't know. I think <laughs> she found it. <laughs> I did. <laughs> uh, oh, Lord. Uh, <laughs> oh, boy. Watch at your own risk. <laughs> I have no risk. Well, I'm just going to say this now. I probably should say plus 18. <laughs> Ultra Godspeed Gears. Jeez. Well, good thing I'm 20. Uh, where should I post it? Just general? No, TV. TV God, I, I, I just realized I'm going to be able to drink next year, and I don't know how to feel about that. Heavily. I, I would have a feeling. Guzzle, uh, guzzle it all day. I mean, my plans are to do a drunk Mario party on my 21st birthday. Oh, God. I, I, uh, for my birthday, uh, I actually do plan to do a Mario Party stream. I want to see if I can get Parsec running so we could probably do, like, an online Mario Party. If I can have, if my computer is built by that time, I will hopefully be able to have Dolphin running on it. Yeah. Okay, what the hell is this? Oh, okay. I recognize it, but I never watched it. This is from Adult Swim, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, no. I I, I recognize it. I always saw adverts for it, but I never watched it. <laughs> yeah, it never seems like my lately, kind of I've been, thing. lately, I've been running into a problem where my targets already know I'm coming, so I get there, and they've already flown the coop. Or worse, they're aiming guns at the door. I'm good, but I'm only good while I'm breathing, so if I get a job that I catch a whiff uh, stank on, I'm going to send you. Nobody knows uh, you just yet. I get it. You must have really made a name for yourself. So It's a pain in the ass. Surprisingly that no I'm one sure. knows cure you yet. It, considering he's taken down four of the five billionaires. <laughs> I'm sure once the, the real battle starts, your training will pay off. Or no doubt uh, you'll learn a few new moves along the way as well. And I'll even let you keep the money you collect. How's that for a little incentive? Uh, Money. Sounds good. I might take you up on that sometime. I want her jacket. That is a pretty nice jacket. Uh. Alright, let's see what the jobs are. Uh. I know this game is massive, but just like the stock animations they have sometimes are on level of PS2 stock animations. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let me tell you who you're up against. The target is a guy called Tetsuya... Tetsuya Nomori. He, he couldn't make do with his money from the girls he lives off of, so he's been taking out loans he's never going to pay back. God, then once the loan sharks see him drowning, uh, he, for, he for risks the loans onto some unlucky lady and moves on to the next gullible floozy, scum of the earth, basically. So why would this be a job for me? Well, this is your first job, so I figured we'd start with someone easy to handle. Besides, guys like him just end up pissing me off too much. God, spe speak it I see. to Tsuya Nomori. I need to play that uh, Kingdom Hearts Rhythm game, which has a canon storyline. I know. Although, I hear it gets insane at times. Well, it looks fun, at least. It does, but still. Figured this will be a cinch, but remember, he'll do anything it takes to get away. If you slip up, you could get yourself killed. You ready for this? Also, they have no. They have that game on Switch. Why not just bring the the collections to Switch? Who knows? Look, I, I kind of get Kingdom Hearts three because it seems like it'd be a little hard for the Switch to run. But even so, why the PS2 games have been out for years? You can easily port those to Switch. 
Yeah, but I feel like if it's anything like that, it'd be like the the two point five, one point five, one point eight. Yeah, that's what I'm uh, talking about. Bring those. Bring those to Switch, like in all in one new little bundle. Mm -hmm. Huh? Is that what they're calling me out there? Only thing they're going to be calling you out there is Tetsuya the dead asshole. If you don't give me what you owe, do it, and I'm and I'm gone. You're Miss Tatsu, aren't you? I've heard about you. I was picturing a, uh, a broad built like a gorilla. And who's this guy? He your pimp? <laughs> yeah, he's ten times better at it than you'll ever be. When did I become a pimp? <laughs> That's also a good reaction image. <laughs> <laughs> Zip it, you're here to put the screws on this lo loser. <laughs> you two done with your little circus act? This meat stack couldn't put the screws on a plank, much less me. You think so? You're about to see what it, what it feels like to get screwed. Mess him up, Kiryu. Mm. Yes, yes, boss. Kiryu, it's time for your weekly uh, loan shark beating. Yes. Yes, Miss Tatsu. <laughs> Chair. Wait, this is. Oh, uh, please. This is the same office. Oh yes. I... It's almost like they only have one office model. Dharma? Dharma! I want to beat him to death with a Dharma doll. Isn't one Pokemon based off those things? Yeah, Dakamara. Yeah. The fire type, right? The... I think fire psychic type. Hmm. Hmm. I, I wanted to kill him with a Dharma doll, damn it. All, all I know is that when they go to sleep, they look more like the Dharma dolls. Good work, Kiryu. You see the look on that guy's face? He'll think twice before he gets into any more mischief. Yeah, I hope you're right. He didn't look like a quick le learner, though. All that just means is that you were way too nice on the guy. If it had been me, well, nice isn't in my vocabulary. You'll still have a lot to learn. I may ask you to help again if something else comes up. Damn, that's a lot of money! You've got a lot to uh, learn before you can beat me. <laughs> learn the guarded weapon charge skill. Alright, what does that entail? Well, it entails guarding. Uh, charge forward while holding a large weapon with your guard up. Oh, so it's just bulldoze over anyone in my way. Got it. All right. Well, we still got a ways to go. I think we need to invest more into beast before we can uh, do any more jobs. Oh, listen! I'm scrolling through my Twitter, and someone is making artwork of uh, the first Kingdom Hearts. If Kyrie had joined Sora, Donald, and Goofy on the journey. So, here, here's a here's a question I'm proposing uh, because. They've already finished one of the story arcs with Kingdom Hearts. Right, the Xehanort saga. And, yeah, they're basically done with Sora at this point. Mm -hmm. Do you think they'll move who on? Do, who do you think... What, who they'll move on to what? next? Yeah, who do you think they're going to uh, use next? Are they going to use Riku or Kairi? Kairi. Or are they going to use someone completely new? I think Kairi, honestly. Uh, given how uh, the... Uh... <laughs> The secret endings came March three went. I want to say Riku, or maybe interchanging between Riku and Kairi. I'm seeing as she is one of the sleep sleeping princesses. I would. Yeah, say she a seven would... princess of heart. Yep. Oh shit! Come on, hit me, hit me, please. Give me those arms! You, you, you just need to add one that's close where he's throwing someone, just add in the yeet sound. <laughs> Alright, dual stab. I don't really have a whole lot of essence of X when it comes to Beast. <laughs> Alright, there was another, let's see, Beast Mastery. 
All right, you know what? Come here, you big... Oh, wait, I think I need heat for this. <laughs> Damn it. I punched him too hard. Oh, good, I hear the question. What do you think you're going to retread Kingdom Hearts 1 again? Mm, give it a couple years. Honestly, I'm surprised Square Enix hasn't decided to just do a full-out remake of that game. But then again, I think they would have troubles, both Disney and Square would have troubles when it comes to Tarzan. Why is that? Disney doesn't own Tarzan, like the actual like, storybook and all that. So they would have to like get rights. Oh, they don't? Yeah, they'd get rights to use it. Ah, uh, okay. That's why there's like, Ooh, that's why in the original game and even in the collection there is a separate like copyright for Tarzan. I never knew that. All right. Uh, so, all right. That, this is the hotel area, right? No. Up oh, there we go. Hotel Mermaid. The hotel is supposed to have a theme, suites, and a variety of decorations. It is expensive. What is not expensive? That's uh, the Hotel Mermaid. Oh, here's a fun little piece of trivia on Nintendo. They used to do love hotels. I I'm sorry, did you say Nintendo? Yes! What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, before, before they were fully into the game industry, they uh, tried their hand at love hotels. Oh god. I know that they used to do card games because Hanafuda was a big thing. Yeah, they they they, they, they basically just did toys, but then when that was starting to faint way now, they decided to try doing uh, love hotels, and then they tried gaming. Hmm, you learn something new every day. All right. Oh, I I can't collect anything because there's trouble brewing. Who are you gonna call? No one! I can handle this myself! You're supposed to cure you. I'm gonna call myself? Yes, that's why I have two phones. Kiryu doesn't even have one phone! Uh, he sold two. Oh. Dragon, this is still the 90s. Cell phones weren't a thing then, and even when they were, they were, they were attached to giant backpacks. Uh, Kiryu's got deep pockets. Alright, big guy. Alright, come on, you. Let's go for a ride. Ring around the posies. Pockets full of money. Alright, you know what? Uh, crawler. Oh, good lord. What? My files have not been opening up quickly for right now. It's weird. Hmm. Is your, like, uh, your hard drive full or something? No, no, like, the actual, like, files are taking, file are taking forever to actually open. Oh, okay. Hmm. Yeah, I know for a fact that, uh, it, it does take, a, a like, maybe a good five minutes. Ooh, special bait. It takes about five minutes for me, uh, the file to open to start the download. No, I was just opening up, the, like, the file application to look through my files. Oh, okay. Yeah, like File Explorer. Wait, what are we still missing? Pocket Circuit, which we can't really do. White Hotel, Hotel Diamond. Oh, Pocket sweet Jesus, tell me over now. There. I still need to find a theater in the hot springs and the the rainbow. Okay, I am just gonna give my computer a quick restart. I'll be right back. Okay. Hotel Blue Light. That is still too expensive. Mm -hmm. That's if the start thing would open. All right, dude. Okay, some... Oh, hello.
Oh, hey, it's that guy. Hold on. <laughs> it's you again. I didn't catch your name during our little money scattering encounter before. It's Kiryu. You always hang around this place? Yes, when I'm in Japan, I travel the world a lot, so I don't get to spend much time here. Don't you ever go home? I'll go home soon. On my next trip overseas. You live in another country? I guess when you're rich, that's an option. No, no, I live in a jumbo jet. A jumbo jet? Oh, okay, Dragon. Take care, dude. Night. Well, I think it's... Uh, think of it like a mobile home. When you're a global business man, you spend more time in the air than anywhere else. I have several private jets, and I switch between them depending on my mood. They're hanging at different airports around the world. Hangar space is a premium with the soaring land prices these days, so it costs me an arm and a leg, huh? Hmm. Anyway, I guess you could say this place serves my serves my office. Okay. I guess this place could serve as my office while I'm in Japan. Welcome to the investment fund, Kiryakun. Investment fund? You wanted to know how I earn my wealth, don't you? Yeah, business may be booming right now, but there can't be too many people earning more money than you know what to do with. You must have a few tricks up your sh up your sleeve. Well, this is how it's done. I just sit here enjoying that drink and wait for the phone to ring. That's it. Sorry, I don't follow. Can you tell me a little bit more? Sure, but it might take a while to explain. You want me to go on? I think this is Kiryu's uh, money transfer to Majima. <laughs> okay, but let me warn you, this could get long. Feel free to zone out if you want to. It won't get you in trouble later. <clears throat> and that's pretty much how the system works. Mm. Hmm, I see. I didn't catch any of that. I died, I died, I died, I didn't either. So when I put in money, it only goes to this M son, and when I take cast injections, it all it's always from him too. That's right. You catch on quickly. Hmm. I wonder where this money's going to, Moon. I don't know, hmm. but he was probably making some great moves last night. <laughs> um, why do we need to go through the fund? Yeah. Hmm? Right. Well, wouldn't it be quicker for m -son and me to just exchange money directly? <laughs> oh, c come on now, Kiryu-kun. How on earth would you find someone you could entrust with that kind of money? Our fund has all the connections to ensure the investments only go to trustworthy parties. That means you can contribute without fear of putting your money at risk. Hmm, you have a point, I have to admit. I know next to nothing about investing. Even though I basically spent uh, the past, what? month and a half investing <laughs> yeah you're far better off using our fund to send money to emson okay i get the picture Phew. so who would emson be in my case well we have candidates all over japan i'm the face of the fund here in kamurocho and we also have a representative re uh, representative in sotenbori osaka sotenbori huh I hear the nightlife industry is really booming over there. The cabaret clubs are like, and the like. That would probably be a good idea area to invest in now. So you're saying the money I contribute would probably go to someone running the cabaret... Oh, sorry. <clears throat> so you're saying the money that I contribute would probably go to someone running a cabaret club in Sotenbori. Huh? <laughs> And the revenue is, and the reverse is also true. Any money contributed to the individual in Sotenbori would come to you in Camarocho. However, we take a cut for our commission, so you wouldn't have, you wouldn't get the full amount. That's just the way it is. So there. Uh, let's see. I think I get how the system works. As a gesture of goodwill, let me make a little contribution to your business, Kiryu. Jeez, ten million. You sure you want to give me all this? I use that money to make your business thrive. And if you make a profit, invest any extra cash you have with us. Like I said in the beginning, we just juggle money. Our business relies on people using the fund. 
Okay, I understand. Oh right. boy. Uh, let's see. Shared item box, so we can give Majima stuff. I'll put that in there. I'm gonna give Majima nothing but mushrooms. He's gonna be like, what the give fuck? <laughs> Alright, how do I actually do... Uh, let's see, get financing maybe? God, I hate this guy's laugh. <laughs> How small? One yen? Two? Tiny investments like that won't land, uh, lead any profit. What's the point? Uh, well, it's just 10 million yen, okay? Fine, good. Where were we then? Fifty percent? Is that all? You gave me ten million yen to start with. Aren't, aren't you talking? Are, aren't you taking a big loss? I'm not worried at all. The money will find its way back to me eventually. You just focus on your business, Kiryu Kun. If you say so. Next time I'll drop my commission to ten percent. Come back when you have some more money to bur burn in a hole in your pocket. You mean like right now? Oh my goodness. Oh, I need to. Oh God, I I need to leave and come back every time. Oof. Don't you love that? Uh, it's great. Oh, boy. Ah, oh, well. It's only 10 million, and I can make that back easily. So, I might as well, uh, up friendship with him. There you go. <laughs> yeah, you want me good- you want to make good terms with, uh, Majima eventually. Yeah. Mm. It's not really that, it's just, uh, whenever we get back to him, he'll be having, like, a boatload of money on him. A hundred million yen?! <laughs> Majima better appreciate this, jeez. Oh, I'm sure he will. For your next, for your next investment, I've been willing to drop our fee to 5%. You'd be a fool not to take me up on it. All right, who's gonna suggest that the next investment's gonna be one billion yen? Do I hear one billion? One billion? One billion? Two billion? One billion? Two billion? Two billion? Three billion? Three billion? Three billion yen? Going once, going twice, going out of Kiryu's pocket. Ten billion. Oh, we got ten billion yen going to Majima. Going once, going twice, going out of Kiryu's pocket. One hundred billion. No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you should put any more money into it just yet. It's important to hedge your risks. You can't put any more money at in this point. As you progress through the story, you'll be able to invest more. Aww. All right, fine. At least, at least it wasn't insane enough to say, "Hey, burn all your money." Yeah, you talk to that girl or no? Nah, talking to her is just basically if you want to play pool. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Alright, that's Hotel Blue Light. And that's nearly a billion. Which you don't have. <laughs> Yet. Well, there's Shakedown. Y you know what? I'm gonna fight him. Oh dear. Just so that way we can uh, get some money. How much does he have? Nine? Only nine million. Eh. Hmm? You piss me off! What? I'm Yuki Sato. What's your name? Kazuma Kiryu. Kiryu, huh? Well, I can't stand you, Kiryu. Your face just pisses me the hell off. Uh? Spoiling for a fight, huh? Well, pick someone else. Uh? It's you I want to fight, because you're seriously pissing me off. Uh? That's your problem. If you don't like me, just walk away. Are you that dumb? Well, Kiryu's track record, I'm gonna say yes. Yeah. Dumb. You're supposed to get on, get on your knees and apologize for ruining my day. And hand over all the money you have, then maybe I'll forgive you. 
Just another shakedown, huh? This town's going to the dogs. What are you mumbling about, you half-wit? Give me money or I'll just have to take it. I've got to vent my stress somehow, right? Alright, uh, you got a vent. Uh, you know what I got? I got gun! <laughs> gun does nothing. Not a golden shotgun. I don't have a golden shotgun. That's what I meant. See? No golden shotgun. Get up, get up, get up! Woo! It's a good thing I got that, uh, tonic from the vending machine. Yeet. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, I wonder, can I break his arms? Probably not. Oh, but I can give him a bear hug. No, I could get the heat move on him. I just hit the wrong button. I did the bear hug instead. Oof. Oh. Ah. I fucking just saw get that. <laughs> e. Uh-oh. Got him. Clotheslined his ass. I didn't even hit him. I I ran past him. <laughs> I guarded it. I should teach it. you to pick a pick your battles more carefully. <laughs> you did better than I expected. That's the most fun I've had in a long time. You might have enjoyed it this time, but bother me again. I'll make sure you don't feel like laughing. You're funny. No, I take that back. You're damn annoying. Never been this pissed off in all my life. I bet it would be feel great to take you, uh, take all this pent up anger out on someone. Tell you what, I'll leave you alone until I can't hold in my rage anymore. And then, well, you better leave town if you want to reach a ripe old age. Oh dear. That's a threat. There's no talking to a guy who attacks others for no reason. I'll have to toughen myself up just in case. Alright, where the hell are these hot springs? Ooh. There's also a theater somewhere that we could invest in, but I can't find it anywhere. I think it's the theater that uh, the you did the Miracle Johnson in front of. No, because that's Maharaja. The place that we're looking for is uh, Kogetsu. Yeah, I know. But remember, in the beginning of that mission, you started out in front of a theater, not the Maharaja. Where was that? Mm -hmm. okay. Let's see. Camaro Hot Springs ho and the hotels, which are pretty easy to find. Uh, the Rainbow is so still something we need to find. And the Pocket Circuit Stadium, I know where that is. Well, while I try to figure that out, I'm going to head back and get some money, and maybe we can buy a new place after I teach these guys a lesson. <laughs> Give me those arms! Yoink! Oh dear. Excuse me. Oh, that fucking dislocated arms. Ouch. Come on. Come on. Why are you running? Why are you running? I want to slam his head into the car, but I will go. Uh, platinum plate. Nice. I love how, like, these random citizens, like, just carry plates on them. <laughs> it's like... 
all right, I'm going to leave my house with my most expensive plate. And just all of a sudden, I'm going to get jumped. And a superhero comes along. Please don't call Kiryu a superhero, because now I'm just imagining him running around in a cape. Da, 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 da. <laughs> I, I paid a million yen and I got a soft shell turtle. No, little turtle. Where, where was that when I got when I was playing this Majima that one time? Turtle, turtle, turtle. <laughs> uh, what am I gonna do with you someday? Mm, I don't know. <laughs> I've never even seen that movie, and I know that reference. Cocaine! Oh god. Looks like Aw, cocaine. <laughs> Just put a green, put a big old pink wig on him. He'll look like Roxo the Clown. <laughs> mm -hmm. Alright, Leisure can work there. I will have the Mafia boss work there. Mm -hmm. Let's see, spinning. He's only on his second day, so it's only going to be average. Is Nugget taking uh, a break? <laughs> ah, damn it. We should have used Johnson. All right. This has to do it. There we go. Come on. A rank. Damn. Come on. S rank. There we go. Come on, seriously? Mm -hmm. It's taken forever to level these scenes up. <laughs> Alright, he's working on his second day. Those are good. Those are good. Almost, and Mama will work on that, and probably not going to be enough for a B rank yet. Alright. There's our money. Woohoo! We have enough to buy a building. <laughs> Alright. I. Oop. Who are you again? Oh, Li Lung. Oh, you! You helped me w with the Momon deal. Oh, yeah. You're the guy that gave me the password. Li Lung, was it? Right, Li Lung. I was looking for you. What? Why? I don't want any trouble. You're a man who gets things done. You help me with more deals. Look, I appreciate your help with the password, but I don't want to get involved with any other deals. Sorry. Oh, I knew you'd say that, but I, d but I don't give up. If I help, you'll change your mind someday, so I'll help you with your business. Having someone like you with the knowledge of the underworld would actually be pretty, uh, be a pretty big help. Yes, I can help you. Okay, it is settled. I will work really hard. Oh, he's security too. Remember when I started this night say, oh god, he is horrible until the very last day. <laughs> Just according to plan, now I'm on the inside. One day, I'll make him mine. Hmm? Hey. You know I heard all that, right? Well, whatever. Thank you for the help. Anyways, uh, we're gonna go to the temple because we got a lot of TP we can spend. Yeah. And then we'll go and see what we can uh, buy in terms of buildings. <laughs> Let's see. One. Side story-wise, 
we still got to dance, and we the only other thing is dancing and uh, pocket circuit. Oh, and uh, go on a date. Oh, oh dear. So what what do you think we should do? Should we go on a date? Should we dance, or should we do some racing? Hmm. Race. <laughs> Race. All right. All right. Disposable income. People flock. Battle. Give me that money magnet. Money, money, money. Twenty-four limit breaker. Certain battle style beyond its limits. I think that's the new style we're working our way towards. Nice. And then the golden pistol, which is forty CP. Damn. I don't care if there was a million getting machine back there, I gotta run! Here you go, zoom! <laughs> Alright, let's swing by the hotel district because there are there is a hotel I can buy. Mm -hmm. I'll just get the first one I come across. Which I think is right here. Yep, Hotel White. God, Media King's gonna take forever to get through. <laughs> oh boy. Everything is just so damn expensive over here. Yeah, very. Now I'm curious about something. Oh dear. <laughs> All right, let's go racing. Ah, Cosmo Coon, good to see you. Are you here to race? Uh, let me customize my car real quick. Do you want to know what one billion yen is worth in U.S. dollars? Sure. Nine million one hundred eighty-four thousand two hundred fifty-four dollars. Hmm. <laughs> That's a lot of money. <laughs> mm, yes, it is. Uh. Alright, what's good? Let's see, cornering's bad. <laughs> you need your car, Killer B. <laughs> that that's just what what the model is called. Oh. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's go with sixty-one thirty-one. We'll go with the Godspeed motor. Mm. Ultra Godspeed gears. Up just cranks the speed all the way up there, but I need to work on getting that grip. Get a high-speed battery. Get a side stabilizer. There you go. Bumper plate. Uh, that adds balance, so we'll keep that. Oh, that actually looks really nice. <laughs> there we go. All right. Uh, let's see. Tires. Uh, speed goes down, but the grip goes up.
Work goes up, acceleration. Let's see if we can do this, and if we can get the speed to go up a bit. There we go. Alright, let's see how this works. Mm -hmm. Uh, rookie race. Let's see, Param God. There's a loop and a wall. Jeez. Hmm. Let's go with this one. Oh, I see. So you need us. Uh, oh, I see. Okay, let's see. 25, 30. Okay, so it goes up every time. Mm. Alright, so we're gonna need a little bit more speed. Soft Tires Plus is actually the best tires I have for grip, so I'm going to keep that. Rubber frame would be good for corners. This should be good. Alright. <laughs> Let's do this. <laughs> Go, Pink Devil! And rough! <laughs> Oh, I'm scared. There, there is a jump uh, almost immediately. Oh no, we, we're taking these corners way too fast. It's gonna go flying off the edge. My tiger no. has been declawed and went flying into a mom's face. <laughs> All right, I need I need to reduce that speed just a bit. Just a little bit. What cracks me about this whole thing here, this whole little racing thing, is the guy in the racing suit. <laughs> Why? He's just very enthusiastic about racing. About little car racing. <laughs> Alright, I need to reduce it just a bit, not way too much. Got speed, high speed. Actually, that high speed motor would probably be better. Uh, that's way too way too heavy. The bumper plate should be good though. Yeah. Alright, little guy. Get us a win. <laughs> and it's off! Alright, not as fast, but it, we're still keeping a good lead. The, my biggest concern are these big uh, turns up here. Mm -hmm. And we can make it! Go, little buddy! Go, 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 go! Stay on, stay on, slide. I think I might have... Oh, oh, wow, we just went flying off. Oh, no. We literally corkscrewed our way out of there. Ugh. The defeat on the face is just great. <laughs> it's like, no! Damn, how could this happen to me? How could this happen to me? No! <laughs> <laughs> You're the one that said it first. Alright, uh, maybe 
tires. Let's see. So anything that gives me a little bit more speed. Not at the cost of anything else. Alright, uh, maybe we'll just take care of the bumper. High capacity, no. Stick with the high speed. Boost gears, acceleration goes down, acceleration 80. We'll go to the balance gears plus. Alright, here we go. Ah, uh, no, we're still too fast! Seriously? How much more slower can you get? I don't know. <sighs> okay, so it, the long turns were good, but it's the, those tight turns. Oh no, I just realized this is a 12 lap race. You're getting there. Uh, so far, so good. I'm, I'm worried about this inmost turn, though. Well, oh, nope, we're good. Nope, we're not. Oh, boy. Come on, Gol Golem Tiger. We can do this. We're halfway there. Ooh. I am not touching that boost button whatsoever. Don't need to. <laughs> Is this the calm before the storm? I am the storm. Raging storm. Alright, we're on lap nine. Oh, someone's actually catching up. Yeah, they probably use boost. Oh, two people passed me. Oh. How dare they? All right, I'm going to wait until we get past the turns, and then I'm going to go for the boost. Okay, okay. Yeah, you're in fourth. Go for it! That didn't do anything. Uh, what? we had such a big lead, then what happened? Who knows? <laughs> we lost. We came in dead last. We were, we were ace in this entire race until the very end. Right. But hey, at least you didn't fall off the track this time. Uh, that's true. Let's try our other racer and see if that is better. Yes. Maybe with a smaller frame, uh, it won't go flying off the track as much. Could be. Alright, uh, let's work on getting the grip. No side stabilizer. No bumper. <laughs> Let's go with the high torque. <laughs> tires, we need more grip, so we'll go with soft tires. Alright, that should do it. 
it's still too expensive. Oh dear. Our corner is 99. I think we could probably... There we go. We'll do this. Alright, let's do this. Kick your ass. <laughs> oh no. Oh, oh no, we're flying. Oh no. I'm scared. Oh dear. Alright, turns were good. That jump scares me though. <laughs> Uh, no, we, we might be in trouble. Hmm. That inmost turn, yeah, we're not gonna make it. Stay on, stay on! <laughs> <laughs> no, no chance to save it, it just went boop! <laughs> it just flew. Ah, <laughs> <sighs> uh, damn. Retired. Hey, Kazuma kun. Mm. Hmm? <laughs> mm, what does this small child want? Oh, he's one of the pocket circuit kids. Kaku Takuma, I think. Mm. Ah, that's right. The fighter was saying everyone here refers to each other informally with kun or chan. Being called kun by a little kid is kind of annoying, but when in Rome, do as the Romans do. I'll get over it. <laughs> I am Kazuma kun. What's up, you're, uh, Takuma-kun, right? Ah. Yep, Kazuma-kun. Um, you only started Pocket Circuit a little while ago, right? Just like me. I just got started, too. <laughs> Is that so? What made you get in the Pocket Circuit? Um, it's because my best friend started playing. Oh, cool. You want to play together. So, how's it going? Are you having fun with your buddy? Actually, we don't talk very much anymore. You used to teach me all sorts of things before, but now... Huh? That's too bad. I don't know why. Maybe it's because my car's slow. You must think I'm a loser. Kazuma kun what do you think? Oh dear. Well, I don't know your friend, but I don't think he'd stop being friendly because your, your car happens to be slow. Besides, pocket circuit racers improve themselves through competition. They race, learn what they need to do to win, and customize the cars to get there. That's the fun part. You think so? I wish I could play with him again like before. I know. Hey, Kazuma kun Hmm? Huh. What is it? Let's race! You and me! With you? Huh. Yep, I want to get faster. Please race me. Please! Oh, <laughs> you said I'll get faster by competing, so compete with me. He wants to race, huh? Do I accept? I'm not going to back down to, to a small child, so yes, I accept. That's the way sure, challenge TV. accepted. <laughs> but this race is the real deal. Don't expect any mercy. Not going to hold back either, Kazuma Kun. <laughs> Alright, pretty standard. Uh, cost limit is 20. Go with balance gear plus. Three, two, one, zoom! 
you know, and we just lapped him. Mm. <laughs> He's so sad in this portrait now. Oh my god, he, he's, his car died mid-track. Oh no. Are we gonna lap him again? Are we actually gonna lap him again? We lapped him! <laughs> Port lapped. <laughs> just wanted to raise and get better. Look at that genuine smile. Hooray, I beat a small child. Ha. Wait, no. Ha. Ha. <laughs> oh, I lost. Sorry, Cosmic Coon. I bet that was boring for you. It's no fun watching... Uh, it's no fun racing against a slowpoke like me. <laughs> I bet Hideki Coon thinks so, too. I don't think so. You made me go all out. And I stomped you into the dirt! I think it's true that you have room for improvement, but you really deserve gut- You, uh, you really d drive gutsy. I like your style. <laughs> really? Yeah, I bet your friend doesn't think racing against you is boring either. Maybe there's another reason why he's avoiding you. Do you think so? Maybe it's that ugly jacket you're wearing. <laughs> Like, did you take someone's tablecloth and decide to wear it as a coat? <laughs> yeah, it has to be something else. You should work on your courage and ask him... Uh, you should work up the courage and ask him directly. Oh. You're right, Kazuma-kun. I'll go ask Hid Hideki-kun. It's a little scary, though. Your buddy's name is Hideki-kun? Yep, he's way faster than me. But I bet you could do just as good as him, Kazuma-kun. Oh, yeah. Kazuma Kun, you can have this. It's a decal. Blue Bolt. A decal. Yep, you can change your pocket circuit card design with it. It's pretty cool. Alright, I forgot those sticker things. I'll try it out later. Thanks, little dude. <laughs> yep. See you, Kazuma Kun. I'm going to the children's park. That's where Hideki Kun usually hangs out. Sure, you do that. Oh, yeah. Cosmic Kun, thank you for everything. Racing with you made me feel better about Hideki Kun. Let's race again sometime. Aww. Bye. Children's Park, huh? Maybe I'll drop by later. I am Cosmic Kun, and I wipe the floor with you! Oh, stop. <laughs> Listen. In Pocket Circuit, there is no mercy, only blood. Oh, dear. You heard it, TV, from... Oh, I can't speak. Oh, I've already bought out the entire stock of stuff. Never mind. <laughs> well... <laughs> Fighter, I want a rematch! <laughs> okay, uh, let's see... Gears... Uh, we'll keep the torque motor. Cornering's bad, but weight goes down. <laughs> Alright, what, what is... A little less than 40, or a little more than 40. Boost gears, no. Alright, never mind. <laughs> Hopefully, this will do it.
Alright. I'm gonna give myself a little bit of a boost after we get past these turns. <laughs> Oh, wow! Oh, no! Oh, no! We're, we're still going too fast! Oh, dear. Damn. We went, we were still going too fast. I don't know why the boost was taking that long. A little too fast. A lot too fast. <laughs> I am winning this race. I don't care how long it takes. <laughs> We're gonna be here for a long time. Alright, let's try this again. <laughs> oh shit! Alright, now I'm scared. <laughs> ah, stone! No! Ah, just barely. Oh dear. Uh, at least these long turns are gonna save me. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. We might be in trouble. Hmm? Oh, I thought you said something. Mm. Just making random sounds. <laughs> okay. Alright, so far so good. So far, so good. We're in lap eight. Uh-oh. People are starting to catch up. I might need to use a boost right here. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Okay, too fast. Too fast. Okay, thank God. <laughs> All right, slow down. Good. So far, so good. Alright, lap 11. <laughs> doing good, doing good, doing good. Okay, why are we getting slower now? I don't like this. No! 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 Oh, no. Damn it! We were... Oh, we were so close! <laughs> Second place, though. I mean, you did better. Last place! I think your battery might be dying on there. <sighs> that might be the case. Mm. <laughs> Two, she's getting mad. <laughs> <laughs> All right, customize motor. Its cars go fast, but may actually be so fast it may actually be a problem. Mix a balance motor, motor that strikes balance between torque and RPM.
Oh, that scared me. Ugh. Battery, high capacity. Low voltage, high capacity, good for long races, and that is a pretty long race. Mm hmm. This should do it. Maybe that's why I kept losing at the end because my battery was dying. That could be. That could very well be. Nope, you stay on there. <laughs> stay on there. Uh, I'm just barely come on. Oh, and we're off. Wee. <laughs> <sighs> Alright, I can't I can't take Sad Cure You anymore. I think we're gonna give Pocket Circuit a break for tonight. <laughs> oh boy. Oop, I think I saw something shiny over here. Yep. Got a card. Cards. I think, uh, let me look. Inventory. I think we did complete the entire set, and I know that, unfortunately, we got to talk to Libido about a full set. Unfortunately, uh, thankfully, we don't, so we don't have to talk to him. <laughs> Come on, Hideki Kun, let's race. Hmm? Oh, hold on, 10,000 yen? Oh, hi, cosmic -kun. Did you want to play with us? Yeah. No, not exactly. I thought I heard a familiar voice, and it turned out to be you. So, how'd it go? Are you back in good graces with hideki -kun? <laughs> Well... I'm... I'm busy now. I don't have time to race with you, takuma -kun. You say you're busy, but it's just us, and you don't seem to be doing anything. Well, I'm about to be busy real soon. Just go away, takuma -kun. What are you doing, Hideki-kun? Oh! Mika-chan! Hideki-kun, who are these guys? Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> this is my pocket circuit buddy, takuma -kun, and... And kosma -kun. Oh, how neat. I don't have any pocket circuit friends besides Deku-kun. Can you be my friend too? Oh, of course. Right, Kazuma-kun? <laughs> uh, sure, no problem. Damn it. My chance to score has failed. Isn't Kazuma-kun really cool? He's super fat. He's a super fast pocket racer too. Oh, wow, neat. Kazuma Kun is cool, isn't he? And he's all grown up. And he's even a fast racer, too. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. Why do I hear sirens in the distance? I really like boys who are good at pocket who are good pocket circuit racers. Oh dear. <gasps> uh okay. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, hold it! Stop right there! Whoa! What's the matter, Hideki Kun? Mika chan, I'm. I'm faster than Kazuma Kun, and. and I'm cooler too! Huh? Um. whatever. I'm pretty sure Kazuma Kun is way cooler. 
I mean, I've nearly killed several people, so yes. I get it now. Hideki-kun has a thing for Mika-chan. He wanted to keep Nika-chan all to himself, so he tried to keep Takuma-kun away. Wow, there's intrigue amongst the little kids. I'm faster for sure, and I'll prove it. Kazuma-kun, I challenge you to a race. Oh, dear. A race? With me? Yep, I'm going to prove to Mika-chan that I'm faster than you. I'm going to go get ready at the Pocket Circuit Stadium. Don't chicken out. I'll be waiting. I will be waiting. Let's go, Mika-chan. Huh? Uh, okay. Bye, Kazuma-kun and Takuma. <laughs> wow, it's going to be so aw awesome watching you race, Kazuma-kun. Hideki-kun's pretty fast, too, so watch out. How did I get dragged into this? But I can't back down now. <laughs> I gotta go beat a small child again. Uh, wait, hold on. <laughs> in a race, in a race. N not the usual Kiryu way. I, I, I'm not. <laughs> uh, Lordy Lou. <laughs> uh, every time I feel like I get to escape this place, they drag me right back in. Oh, Kazuma kun, I was waiting for you. Are you ready to race? Nope. <laughs> I guess I'm ready to roll whenever you are. All right, don't go slow because I'm a kid. <laughs> Absolutely blows his car out of the water. Oh no, what is this track? What? I can't hear it. What's it sound like? No, just I'm looking at the layout of this thing. It's just oh my god. Oof. Bumper plates. Alright, we need to reduce our speed just a little bit. Boost gears, battery, then stays that. Oh, that's way too much speed. <laughs> Fine, uh, no tires are good. Just need to drop it down by two. Guess I can take the bumper off. God, th this hurts to look at. I'm scared. <laughs> oh boy. Oh no, we're way too slow. Stay on! Stay on! Uh, let's see. Yeah, we we need more speed. That is way too slow. <laughs> it is like, see, and it's like, oh shit, that is slow. <laughs> Kazuma Kun, you should go work on your car and try again. We'll give Kazuma Kun a rematch, won't you, Hideki Kun? What? 
Uh, okay. Whatever, I accept your challenge anytime. Alright. More speed, less grip. They really do not give you a whole lot to work with. Not really. All right, this should do it. <laughs> Hopefully. Ah, it still starts out slow. But we are picking up pace. There you go. As long as you're picking up, right? <laughs> yep. Oh. oh, oh, yeah, we are absolutely just, we are just destroying him. <laughs> this is even a challenge. It's almost kind of embarrassing at this point. For this kid? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Listen, in Pocket Circuit, we humiliate the losers. Oh, dear. Hmm? I saw What's some up? catch up for a minute there. Yep, we're, we're still we're still in the lead. I didn't even have to boost. We won. Woohoo! You won us. You won one race. Finally. Hey, we won another race earlier. Did we? Yeah, against Takuma. Oh yeah. Duh. <laughs> that does... Although, granted, it, it was really slow and pitiful, so I don't really count it as a race. That's what I say. That doesn't count. That poor kid couldn't even get a car to go fast. <laughs> we lapped him twice in that race. <laughs> that was so fast. Way to go, kazuma No way! Sorry, but I didn't think you want me to go easy on you. It's okay. Kazuma Kun, you're awesome. I've got a little, I've got a long way to go. I was only thinking about Mika Chan lately, so I wasn't even racing with Takuma Kun or my other buddies. Maybe that's why I got so slow. Could be. Pocket Circuit racers get better by competing and learning from it. So how about racing with Takuma Kun again? <laughs> yep, I'm gonna practice lots more with Takuma Kun and my other friends. Compete, uh, compete with them and get super duper fast. And. Win fair lady's heart. <laughs> I'm gonna win Mika Chan over. <laughs> like your guts. Go for it, little dude. Yep, I wanna race you again too, Kazuma Kun. Oh god. Hey Takuma Kun, let's go practice. Huh? Uh sure. <laughs> that worked out, I guess. At least those kids have patched things up. Kazuma Kun Oh dear. Why do I hear sirens in the distance? 
You were so fast and so cool. My heart was thumping just watching you. Oh, dear. Uh, great. Thanks. You really are cool. Maybe I can even be your girlfriend. Oh, dear. <laughs> what? G girlfriend But I don't want someone who's slower than me. <clears throat> That's why we should race. If you win, if I win, I'll be your girlfriend. No, wait, I... Okay, bye. If you want to race me, I'll be right here. No. No. <laughs> oh, boy. I got dragged into another mess. Even for kids, romance sure is one tough obstacle course. Kiryu, no. Kiryu, please. <laughs> you need contemplating Kiryu on this one. <laughs> Where is he? What am I doing with my life? <laughs> oh, Cosmic Coon, are you ready? If you beat me, you can beat my boyfriend. Right, throw the race, got it. Oh, for crying out loud, do you even know what that means? Of course I do. A girlfriend is a lover, and she gives her most important thing to her boyfriend. <clears throat> Oh, yep, those are definitely sirens I'm hearing. So if you win, I'll give you my most important thing to you. Huh? What? Wee -oo, wee -oo, wee -oo. <laughs> I heard kids are growing up f a lot faster, but this is something else. What's gonna- what is going to happen to this country? Didn't know we were in Tennessee. <laughs> <laughs> okay. She's only in elementary school. No, 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 no. Kiryu, you. No. Why is she going there? Kiryu. you. Stop it. What's wrong, Cosmic Coon? Huh? Oh, uh, nothing. Really. I do sewing and knitting all the time for home, home ec, so I'm really good at doing tricky customizing. Oh, dear. You better not think this will be easy. Are you ready to race, Cosmic Coon? No. The whole girlfriend and important thing bit aside, I'm not running from a challenge. Uh, yeah. <laughs> sure, let's race. I'm going all out. No fooling around. I'm gonna be all business too. It's on, Cosmic Coon. Shama. Please tell me you give me. Please tell me you give me more to work with this time. Game twenty five. Okay. Oh no, it's this one. Huh? Is it the loopy loop? Yes. Oh no. Alright, I got five to work with. Let's go to speed frame. <clears throat> Tires. Uh, what do we got to work with? I need something good. Try that. Uh, let's see. Do not want any more power than there already is. <laughs> How many laps is it? Twelve. Ah, oh, guys, it, it's twelve. Yeah. In that case, uh, high capacity. Gears. I need something with. Oh god, that speed is pitiful now. Wait, why is the speed so low now? Ooh, 
God damn, I can't stop yawning. Sorry. <laughs> You're cool. Still got two to work with. That's good. Let's see. Frame. Let's see if we can go down to one. All right. Hopefully this will do it. <laughs> oh god, this one is horrible. Oh boy. <laughs> All right, little car, let's do this. All right, uh, pretty solid lead at the start. Uh, my biggest fear of these turns, though. Yep, almost immediately. Oh, boy. And that was on the outs. That was on an outer turn, so I'm scared about what these ones are doing. Yep. I think we went too fast. Yep, we lost. You know what? Go big or go home! <laughs> Yay! Oh dear. That was good. <laughs> the end. Yeet! <laughs> Just launch it right into Mika's head. Knock some sense into her. I lost. Okay. A bit more grip and a little less speed. Also cornering. I need to work on get the, getting that cornering up. Yeet. That's good. I think the frames are cornering. Alright, let's try this. Alright. Round two. Oh, boy. Uh, that's still probably too fast. Yep, oh, alright, so far so good. Here's the real test, though. Good, good. Nope, not good. Oh, what? <laughs> How did... What? Um, excuse me. We completely went the wrong way. Oh, no. Okay, a lot less speed. Oh, boy. All right, let's see. Keep the battery as that. Mm -hmm. 
Soft tires have good grip. Oh, that's actually pretty good. All right. Now, this one. This is the one. I can feel it in my bones. I hope. <laughs> I hope you're right. <laughs> I'm feeling it in my bones. We got this. I don't think we have this. All right, nope, uh, uh, yeet! Oh, God! Too fast, too fast, too fast! Whoops. Ah! Ow. <laughs> Sorry. I can't tell where she is. But the fact that I don't see her car is a good sign. I think I caught a, a quick glimpse of it. It just went past like the, the little ramp that swaps the the lanes. Mm. Yep. Alright, we're basically on opposite ends of the track. Woohoo! She's just going up the second ramp now. <laughs> I don't wanna be an eight-year-old's boyfriend. <laughs> I don't wanna be the very best, like no one ever was. Oh, this race is my real test. Customizing is my cause. Oh my god. I will I will sprint across the land, searching far and wide. These pocket racers to understand the power that's inside. Uh. Yakuza! It's you and me. You fucking don't. I know it's my destiny, Yakuza. Oh, you're my girlfriend. Why are the police coming to my door? Fucking <laughs> door. <laughs> yes, I know Kiryu's a dork. We all know Kiryu's a dork. So are you. <laughs> Oh, oh, I'm insulted by something that is so true. <laughs> I lost. You really are fast, Kazumakun. Yeah, but your car was no slouch either. Your customization is smart. I could learn a lot from it. Okay, I promise. So I'll be your girlfriend. <laughs> Get that saxophone out of here right now! <laughs> huh? It... Yeah. What the hell is this music? I can't hear it. <laughs> you might want to t t just turn on for like half a second. Oh boy, hilarious. I'm very concerned right now. Moon? I'm very concerned. <laughs> Why? Yeah. Why is there uh, about that? Why, uh... Move it on. Move it on. I'm gonna give you my most important thing. Wait, no. Hold on. This sort of thing is against the law, and it's just not. Here you go. You got the drag on. 
instead of boost gears. Huh? This is a pocket circuit car. <laughs> it's the most important thing to me. <laughs> you can have a cosm coon to show everyone that you're my boyfriend. <laughs> this is how it should be. That'll teach me not to let my imagination run wild and leap at the worst conclusions. <laughs> you need to make that one. You just need to phrase frame that one, too. <laughs> <laughs> this, th this is my life right now. You don't like my gift? Huh? No, no. Not at all. <laughs> this is great. Thank you. <laughs> You're so weird, Kazumakun. Are you really sure about this, though? It's okay, I have another car. I think you can make this one go faster than I could, anyway. <laughs> Understood. I'll treat it with care. Sweet. From now on, you're my boyfriend. Oh, God. Uh, uh yeah, of course. <laughs> I'm so happy. See ya, Cosmicoon. Oh, God. A little fatuation. What? Wait, whoa, 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 what? What? I can't believe I let myself get flustered. I still have a lot to learn. What is going on back there? Hmm, hmm stare. Hmm. Damn, Kiryu's got a nice butt. <laughs> Alright, fighter. One last challenge. Now that I was able to beat that little girl at that race, I know for a fact I can win this race. Oh, boy. Uh... <laughs> nope. Uh, damn it. That's not what I wanted. I want to customize, I want to race. Let's do this. Alright, start off slow, but sooner or later we'll get up there. <laughs> Oh god! <laughs> too fast, too fast! Slow it down there, cure you! Should have waited till I uh, did the wider turns. Hmm. Alright, we're gonna save the second boost for when we're close to the end, so maybe like lap 11. Yeah. I wonder how big these tracks can actually get in real life. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm sure they can get pretty big. I think they're pretty expensive too to do this. Oh, problem. I'm sure they're definitely expensive. <laughs> We might not actually need to use the boost here. I think we're about ready to lap somebody. <laughs> uh, what, what were you saying? Sorry. It's okay. Uh, my cousin 
I think if I remember, I think he had a little track like this. Like a Hot Wheels track or just like a pocket RC car track? Like this, like a, a pocket thing. Ah, pocket racer? Yeah. All right, last lap. And so far, we are on someone's ass, and no one is close to beating us. I think we got it this time. Don't jinx yourself, now. <laughs> well, seeing as how we just won the race, I'm pretty sure I don't have to worry about jinxing myself. <laughs> Kazuma-kun, you're doing pretty well today. Thanks, I'm trying to get my time down. Oh, what? Mm. What? Why, why the panic all of a sudden? Sorry to start you, Kazuma-kun. It's just, I... I forgot some important business I have to take care of today. Important business? Uh, I feel bad for the kids, but... I have to go. Hey! What was that all about? Hey, where did Fighter go? I have no idea. He left in a hurry. Said he had important business. What? No way! Without Fighter here, there won't be any pocket circuit races. We have to do something. We have to drag him back, kicking and screaming if, if we have to. You're right. Huh? Fighter ran off somewhere? How could he just leave us here? When's Fighter coming back? Your guess is as good as mine. If only I knew where he went, I could find out what happened. I saw Fighter when I was walking around town the other day. Are you sure? Where'd you see him? <laughs> On Namakichi Street. I thought it was strange for him to be there when we had Pocket Circuit uh, pocket circuit term Tournament today. Namakichi Street, huh? Maybe Fighter is on Namakichi Street now. I'll go check. No, wait. It isn't safe for kids around Nam Namakichi Street. But I guess I could go see if Fighter is there. You just wait here, okay? Yeah, all right. Thanks. Kazuma Kun. Uh. <laughs> I like how you Sure, leave this to that. me. <laughs> Bring back Fighter for us. Even if you have to beat him to a bloody pulp, we'll be waiting. Uh. Beat him to death with a pocket circuit car. Uh, how far, uh, where is Nin uh, Namakichi, Ping, Tenkaichi, Tehai, ah, there. Alright. I say we swing by the office, we'll go to the street, see what Fighter's up to, and then we'll probably call it for tonight, because it is getting late. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <sighs> Ugh, I'm so out of shape. I don't know how. <laughs> Freaking Yakuza, dude. <laughs> you don't know how Q's out of shape so much? No, I don't. <sighs> I should not have eaten that ramen bowl. I should have been playing too much pocket circuit, not enough fighting. <laughs> or wearing a suit. <laughs> I should be wearing track suits instead. Hmm. No, uh, money battle. That's shocking. Maybe not enough yet. Hmm, <laughs> maybe. But usually, it's every time we collect money from a district that still has a billionaire in it. Hi, Tamo. Um, Hi, Tamo. Hello. How are you? Ah, damn it! How are you tonight? Well, I got up from sleep, too, while I could throw them. The second coming of naps. You could call it that, yes. Huh. And how was your nap? I call my first sleep the nap. 
<laughs> it was only four hours. Only four? Only four. Jeez. I'm so jealous. I can't really function off of that flash anymore. Anyway, I saw Yakuza and I knew I had to come. <laughs> yeah, it's been it's been a night. All right, let's get the money paid out. <sighs> but has it been a Mr. Libido night? No, not yet. We haven't seen him. Oh, okay. But I do have to say this. I think I have my own Mr. Libido at my place of work. <laughs> does he have the voice? He looks like him. <laughs> but does he, he have had, the voice? If he had the voice, I would die right there. <laughs> <laughs> then he is a false Libido. I don't know. <laughs> He's all in tactical gear. I wouldn't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. The the line false libido is just ugh. He is a false libido. Until I hear him talk, then I will t let you know, but I took a picture, but it's gone. Oh, there's fighter. Hold on. <sighs> Hold on, this guy's wearing a, a, a flashy suit. I had to beat the crap out of him. Oh, yep. Go. You have to, it's like the law or something. Come at me, bruh. Alright, you know what? Give me those arms! Oh, this just makes it hurt. My arms hurt! <laughs> Don't worry, he's only sleeping. He's not dead. Ooh, just dislocate the shoulders. Right? <laughs> he's not dead, he's just in a lot- in so much pain he kinda wishes he was dead. <laughs> what? Exactly! Why can't I feel my arms? <laughs> I know why I- How about some pocket tissues? I know why my pocket shoulders hurt. <laughs> yeah, my arms hurt after seeing that. Boy. Those pocket tissues hey, actually um came in handy for one story, one of the side stories for me. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, you know that uh policeman that stops and searches you. Oh yeah, that. I always fed him that. I always fed him the pocket tissues. <laughs> I just fed him pocket tissues. <laughs> It's like, do you have anything dangerous on you? Feeds him po like, shows pocket tissues in his mouth. Nope, everything looks fine here! I, I got a hanky, to, is that dangerous? In Kiryu's hands, yes. <laughs> well, it depends. In some countries, they're, uh... They're illegal. kazuma -kun, what are you doing here? Without you, we can't hold any pocket circuit races. Well, why not? It smells like Twitter. Talk. What are you? What are you doing here, anyway, fighter? Well, you see, I'm in massive amounts of debt, and my wife left me, so oh. I'm selling tissues on the side of the road. I see. So you've been handing out pocket tissues part time, huh? Yeah, I have a few part time gigs going on right now. The pocket circuit job is one of them. That's a part time job too. Yep, 8.50 yen an hour. Doesn't pay much, huh? It's pretty bad. Handing out tissues only gets me uh, 10.50 an hour. That's why I had to come do this job. Okay, I get why you left, but you should still head back to the Pocket Circuit Stadium. Kiryu! This guy is working a second job to help, you know, pay for his life! It's just like, yeah, yeah, we need you to come back and uh, referee a Pocket Circuit competition. You've given out all the tissues, right? I don't know if I deserve to go back. Huh? I chose this over my pocket circuit job. I put my own selfish needs ahead of the dreams of those kids. 850 an hour or not, 
What right do I have to see their smiling faces now? Hmm, looks like Fighter's lost his confidence. I should try to cheer him up some somehow by beating the ever-living shit out of him. Oh, TBG. Always resorting to violence. Well, that's how Kiryu's life is! You need to go back, Fighter. The kids are waiting for you. The kids? But I'm just some part-timer. Why would they need me? The kids really missed you after you left. Some of them even watched... Uh, wanted to go out looking for you. They did? Okay, I'm going back to the stadium. Thanks for making me feel better, cosmic -Cune. I shouldn't be here feeling sorry for myself. Yeah, you're right. I'll see you back at the Pocket Circuit Stadium. Don't forget, cosmic -Cune. Not My God. I'll be waiting for you. Gets mugged on the way back to the stadium. That flashy suit, you would. Even in this time and age. I mean, to be fair, we just beat the ever-living hell out of a guy in a flashy suit just for walking down the street, so... <laughs> he who had money. <laughs> exactly. But I'm saying... You wouldn't get beat and mugged. I think you'd be killed wearing that suit today. <laughs> that sounds like a challenge. Oh. I'm all for it. Oh, Jesus. Oh, what am I going to do with you? I don't know, but I hope it involves a lockbox. What? Just, just lock me away... Keep the cringe contained. <laughs> Fighter, you came back. All oh, right, it's Fighter. Fighter's back. Just had to take a bathroom break. Sorry to keep you waiting. You took your time out there, Fighter. Now, let's get back to the park at circuit racing. Destroy them. Don't worry. I plan to. Take your pocket car. And race so and hard. Launch it right into their face. Yes. <laughs> Take their dreams and aspirations and consume them before their very eyes. Excellent. excellent. Teach those little shits that nothing they ever do will matter. And that uh, their lives are worthless, worthless and have no meaning. Speaking of little shits, oh, Kazuma Kuhn! I'm pretending to be asleep for this, so I don't want to hear the saxophone again. Hey, if it is Amika chan, shaving down your lap times? Yep, my customization worked, and I think my car is a little faster now. Kazuma Kuhn, do you want to? Do you want me to do yours? <laughs> I'm girlfriend after all. <laughs> yeah. No, I should be doing my own car. Even between boyfriend and girlfriend, this is something personal. Aww, I wanted to do the what the hell is going on back there? <sighs> g, g girlfriend Hmm? hmm? Mika-chan, what is the meaning of this? Oh! Satoru-kun! Who's this guy? Your girlfriend is a child this young? Have you no shame? Huh? Uh, no, you got it all wrong. Don't make any excuses. This is unforgivable. We'll settle this with a race. <gasps> Why did it sound like the Doom theme kicked in for a second there? A pocket circuit race? Yes! While I'm a law-abiding citizen of Japan, I am, above all, a pocket circuit racer. I will defer to a faster racer. When did so, the, if when, you beat me in a race, I'm willing to overlook your per, uh, perversion. When did this become Yu-Gi-Oh, but with pocket racer cars? When I first set foot into this building. Come on, we'll yeah. settle this on the track, you pervert. 
We'll settle this we'll on the settle. track, you pervert! We'll settle this in Smash. <laughs> it's a comp complete under misunderstanding, but uh, turning him down now would only make things worse. What do I do? Aww. Beat him to a bloody pulp, of course. Super and make a run for it. <laughs> Smash okay, Bros. Melee, idea about bro. Fox only. Final destination. No items. No, no. God, God no. S Smash Bros. 64. Fox only. Final destination. No items. Okay, you have the wrong idea about me, but you don't seem to be in any mood to listen, so I'll take you on. Then. The meme is melee, though, because Fox was, like, super powerful in that game. Alright, that, that's a weird way to say broken, but okay. You were right. Alright, what, uh, what... What the hell is the, this... Ah! Ow. Uh, let's just stick with Golem Tiger. Go I just wanted to get some pocket. I just wanted to get some pocket circuit parts. Did you lose? No. I got dragged into another race. Uh. That's why he screamed like that, like a banshee. Ree! <laughs> Ow. <Yeah. laughs> Did that actually hurt? A bit. I'm sorry. Oh god! Oh god! I'm sorry, I'll never do it again. You're fine, Tamo. You're good. Cosimo, no. Now I've lost. Your car's too fast. My car's too slow. I mean, it's too slow. I had to use a boost to go that fast. I mean, like, you came off that hill too fast. Well, at least now I can go get some pocket circuit parts. Alright, what do we got? Extra balance frame, light suspension, just gonna buy everything. I'm just gonna look up the best pocket circuit parts. <laughs> I'm sure you gotta get them from like the dream machines. Oh, there's a lot of cups. Mm hmm. Alright, let's try drag on this time. Here's the maze. Alright, we need speed. What's up, Storm? Oh god, do we need speed? I end up story 56. Hmm. Are you on sub story 56? I don't know. I have to check after this. much as I'd like to stay on, it's almost 12 here, and I need to get some sleep. <laughs> okay, Moon. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Since I just woke right, up, I can take keep care. going. Night-night. Night. Bounce out there, catch there. Okay. How sad that it, uh... Their little car, after flying off the thing, was gonna land in a corner. There was no way to, like, recover from that. Yeah. When it kept do doing spins to try and recover, there I knew it was basically doomed. And we're off. Yeah. And, oh god! Jeez! Holy crap! <laughs> you are speed. Wait, <laughs> I am speed. At sometimes. 
Nope, too much speed. Oh, you're in second place when that happened? I think it's because I, I did uh, go flying off and automatically kicked you to second. Mm. Let's see. Yeah, that is way too much speed. Such a dramatic pose with that tiny car. Kiryu is really in the pocket circuit. He's into pretty much everything he does. True. Plant Dragon. One sec. Alright, so far so good. Oh yeah, we are smoking him. My only concern right now is, that, do we have enough speed to beat that loop? Let's find out in just a second. Oh no, what, what does my creaky chair have to say about this? My chair believes in you. Well, at least someone does. <laughs> oh yeah, he's done for. There is no way in hell he is going to win. We, we've we almost lapped him. Yeah. I'm coming for you, Satoru! <laughs> you get back here! I'm going to lap your ass! You just went through him. <laughs> yep. As soon as you lap him, the car stops. Because there's no way they can win. The game knows it. Well, well. My goodness, I never expected to lose. That was amazing, kazuma -kun. You beat Satoru-kun. Whew. You're one tough opponent. Even though not really, I'm just being courteous. Very well. I'm a man of my word. I'll allow you to be Mika-chan's... No. You can be Mika's boyfriend. Uh, yeah. About that. Please. Treat my daughter right. Nani? Daughter? I'm so sorry. I kept accusing you of being a pervert without getting the facts. It's all my fault, so drinks are on me. Yeah, that was pretty awkward. I sure didn't expect you to be Mika-chan's dad, though. Calling her Satoru- Her calling you Satoru-kun didn't help either. Everyone calls each other Kun and Chan in the world of pocket circuit racing, so we just gotten used to it. You know, when in Rome, do as the Romans do. <laughs> heh, that's true. I've done as the Romans do. <laughs> what are you doing here? I thought you were banned from this establishment. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> you never saw me! You get out of here right now! No shirt, no shoes, no service! You never saw me! I got to admit, I'm delighted in having you. A grown-up man as a pocket circuit buddy. We're a rare breed, you and I. Yeah, it's mostly kids. When did you start racing? From day one. When it first went on sale. Wow, that's something. 
Well, I have to confess, I only bought it as a time killer, originally. After all, it's a child's toy, so, or so I thought. But once I built my car, I realized there was so much more to discover. With so many customizable options, it was a thrill seeing my machine just race like I envisioned. Since then, the whole family got into it, even my daughter. Your whole family's into pocket circuit racing? Must be fun. I guess your enthusiasm is what made you so fast. <laughs> oh no, I'm a nobody. In the early days, I managed to win here and there, but not now. There's so many people involved in racing, competition is ramped right up. And of course, there are the three elites. Only three? three elites. Yes, the ace, professor, and champion. A trio of racers I could never beat. They're probably the best in Camarocho. I didn't know there were racers like that. Oh, but you beat me too. You might have a chance against the elites. Why not give it a try, if you get the chance? It'd be swell if you could get revenge for me. Alright, if I if I ever see them, I might give it a shot. Uh. Yes, please. Okay, thanks for the great meal, Satoru-san. Even though we have not eaten anything or even taken a sip of our beer. Nope, that's not allowed. Use pocket circuit racers, always go by Kuhn, even man-to-man. -man. Uh, yeah, okay. Thanks for dinner, Satoru-kun. All right, let's race again sometime, Kazumikun. I hope we can be friends, Mika-chan too. Sure. Mika-chan. And they were never heard from again. Because Kazuma Start took out. them out back and uh, unconscious to them. <laughs> Started out in the, on the wrong foot, but I'm glad I got to a grown-up racing buddy. But there are racers even faster than Satoru Kun out there. Three of them. There's always someone better, and I still and I'm still light years from being the very best. Alright. Well, since how I know what will win that race, I might as well. Do the pro am race. This should be in the bag. Although, there might be a chance this is going to be a close race. Or not. Oh yeah, you were in the lane that had to do the loop first. Yeah, but I'm catching up. I'm already in second. Hold up! Get back in there! Yep. I'd be just casually loop everyone, or lap everyone. I I might lap one person. We'll see. I'm slowly gaining on someone. Afraid to boost. That hill is pretty terrifying. Yeah. And we won. Oh, Yuko. Goodbye, Yuko. Look at that innocent smile. Know how to push the limit, Kazuma Kyun. Awesome. You know, this calls for a celebration. No, not that kind of celebration. Oh god, that is horrifying. 
But I think Dragon should still be able to win this. Trying to make an audible sip from a plastic water bottle just doesn't work. And it makes me sad. J just, like, lightly uh, have the bottle against you and just go... There you go. That sounds so weird! <laughs> I'm scared. Oh god. Ooh. Oh god! Oh god! Oh yeah, you're getting dusted. Oh, this track. Uh... Well, I'm in second place. That's because one of them was in the loop. Well, now I'm in first place. Yeah, I have no explanation for that. Oh, they were also in the loop. Now I'm in the loop. No! I'm scared they used the boost. Cosmo King has lost position. Yeah, that loop is awful. Go for it, go for it! Leave him in the dust, carry you! Oh god! Saved it! Save it, save it, save it, save it! Alright, he's in the loop, I think. Yep. Oh no, I just realized. Our final lap, we're in the loop. Damn it, we've lost. I should have saved it for this round! Save for the loop. Well, at least you maintained second. Third. Yeah, that's true. Well, at least I stayed on the track and didn't get last. Yeah. So, um, what cup are you in? What cup? Yeah. Uh, let me see. That's not good. I'm ready up and ready to go. Let's get started. I am in the experts race. All right. Uh, let's see if we can get this a little bit ah, more speed. Okay. Oh. The site has recommendations, but you won't always win because there's some randomness involved. Right. In let's minute. use our guide gears. Recommended parts for expert race are ultra slick tires, ultra speed frame, godspeed motor, ultra balanced gears, high capacity battery, and heavy suspension. Alright. Oh god, I'm, I'm in the loop at first round. Yeah. Green lane best player. Oh boy. Hey, look at this way. You get the loop over with. Yep. Yeah. Oh dear. Oh no. Too fast. Way too fast. Ah. We'll wait till we get to the lap seven and then we'll use our boost. And hopefully, I'll be able to save it. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, wait, nope, maybe not. We're in first place. We lapped somebody. <laughs> TBG Neum. Yellow has been defeated. Can we lap a second person? No, we're not going to be able to. Yeah, they're on the same lap as you. Yeah. They're not far behind. Uh, no, we're in the loop. This is risky, but I'm doing it. Zoom! Oh, uh, no! Ooh, ooh, no! This was a mistake! I wasn't in the loop! Oh, no. I thought I was in the loop, but I wasn't! Yeah, if you're in green, you're in the loop for the first and fifth lap. Damn it. Damn it's it. once every four lives. We had it. We had it. We had the dream. 
We were this close to greatness. The dream. Oh, wait, did you have any of those parts I mentioned? Uh, probably. Oh, you're on the right. I think you'll right, be in the loop for the let... three and seven. Oh dear. Do I think one? All right. So do you think I'm gonna be able be able to lap somebody this time? Maybe. I'm having to recover a lot during these. Jeez. Oh, it's really using up your gauge every time you have to do that. Oh no. Yeah, it sucks. Yeah, at least you didn't have to on third lap. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but like you said, it's random sometimes when it go comes to going around these tracks. Mm. Like, I've had times where I've uh, jumped off of, uh, like, those little hills and completely somersaulted and didn't have to do anything, and other times where it's just like, Hey, yeah, save me, please! He'll be in the loop, um, seven if you're not already there, and, uh, you know, ahead right. by however many seconds land. Yeah. Don't worry. We clear the loop. No one's near us. If I can just get through this without screwing up this time, we got this. Got it. Mm. Hope we had f a fun race. Hey, fighter. You really seem down today. What's the matter? I can't really talk about it here. Well, let's talk about it over some beer. That always loosens lips. Please, you know Fire would probably just be a person who's be sipping on a juice box. Mine. What, you're moving back in with your parents? Sipping on a juice yeah, box I gotta call like from this? My... No, not like this! I got a call from my mom. She said I'm going nowhere here in the city. I should come home and take over the family business. Joke's on you. I see. What does your family do? Joke's on you. I didn't even consume any souls. I just gave an example. They run, a tof they run a tofu shop. No kidding? What should I do? You're the only one I can talk to about this kind of thing. What do you want to do, fighter? To be honest, I don't know. I can't believe his parents want him to be a soy boy. <laughs> My god. I'll be 30 pretty soon. I can't go on living like this much longer. <coughs> oh, my age! Ow! <laughs> wow, that age just hit you like a truck. I always dreamed of coming to the city, getting impor an important job, and going out with a ton of chicks. Wait. I guess life just doesn't work out like when that. When does this game now take I'm working place? For peanuts. I believe 1998? Okay, he's older than me. Phew! I have no real earning potential and a non-existent love life. At this rate, it'd make more sense to go back home and lighten the load on my parents, but... But... I like being a pocket circuit fighter. It's fun working with the kids. That's why I'm having trouble deciding. <sighs> fighter? Huh? What are you doing here? Did you hear what I was saying? Yeah. Yeah, this is so embarrassing. Hey, and he's off. Yum. He's doing pocket circuit racing, but in real life. Hmm. We just wanted to tell him something. His shoelace was untied. Oh. He did. Yeah, something really important. Uh huh. I wonder where he went. Might not come back to anymore. I might know where he is. Huh? You sure? When he's feeling down, he goes to public park number three. I see him crying on the bench there a lot. That's so sad. He needs a hug. He needs a hug.
<laughs> I'm coming, fighter. Don't worry. Them. What the hell is that thing? Uh, improving digestive tract function. Oh, I guess maybe it lets you eat again. Ah, oh, damn it, he was scared. I could have done that heat move. Alright, maybe I can do it on these guys. But if you do, if you beat up these guys, who will protect the Earth from the aliens? Oh, that's what XCOM is for. But the men in black are our first line of defense. This XCOM is there for, uh... You know, when everyone finds out about aliens. Mm. Umbrella. Jeez, it's already three. We need to wrap this up. Mm -hmm. I think it was getting pretty late for you. Yeah. All right, where the hell's fighter? I guess we just run around until we find him. Which, to be fair, he's not that hard to miss. In a crowd like this, yeah. Ooh, dream machine. Is a... Ah, good. Okay, maybe he's over on the other side. Yeah, it's kind of fucked up that there there's dream machines in this homeless community. You're not wrong. Hey, remember when I said? Oh, wait. It's about park number three. This is the right park, right? Was it? Uh, we'll see. West Park. Nope, public park number three is all the way down by the office. Thankfully, there's a taxi right here. The first time I used a taxi in this game, they said, Oh, we're busy right now, so you're gonna have to spend like 11,000 yen. I did it then, yeah. because I'm, I'm a bitch. I'm a little bitch. <laughs> I like, I'm not walking all the way over there, I don't care. <laughs> it's so far away. Where? 
Ah, damn it, he was scared. Wait. He is scared! Still couldn't pull it off. What exactly do I need to do? Is it just when they're in a, in a scared state? Floating rear guard. Essence of Relentless Barrage. Exploit an opening and the enemies that deliver series of tricky feints and punishing blows. Why towards a fainted enemy? Third health bar. Okay. There he is. <sighs> Cosmo, what are you doing here? Hideki said you'd be here. He was worried about you. Hideki? Go back to work, fighter. Do it for the kids. Heh. <laughs> I make a pretty lousy pocket circuit fighter, don't I? I'm supposed to be someone the kids look up to, but I just keep letting them down. That's not true. Kazuma, no. Kazuma san. Why so formal all of a sudden? I made up my mind. I'm going back to my parents' place. What? Goodbye. Hey. Uh. Oh no. Children. My one weakness. Fighter! Takuma! You all came? You guys couldn't stay away, huh? Uh. Nope. We got sick of waiting. Don't quit, quit, fighter. Eh? We all think you're the best, fighter. Don't give up on your job. But I'm just an uncool part-timer who's never been with a girl. We all know you're not as cool as you, as you make out, fighter. Huh? But we still like you for who you are. Don't quit, fighter. Guys. What should I do, Cosmo Coon? It's your call. Cosmo Coon. Cosmo Coon. Cosmo Coon. Going back to your folks isn't running away. Taking over their tofu business could be good for you. But you're not the loser you think you are. You have plenty to be proud of. <laughs> you run a child's racing game. Just look at how much these kids care about you. That's not something anyone can pull off. Kazuma Kuhn. Mm, processing, processing, processing. Got it. <coughs> ah, this won't do. I need to pull myself together. I feel a lot better now. Thanks to all the to uh thanks to all of you. I should stop being so down on myself. Yeah. Okay, time to clear the air. Let's all head back to the Pocket Circuit Stadium for some racing. <laughs> Alright, you're the best fighter. Thanks, Kesmacune. I feel like a weight's been lifted off my shoulders. Here, take this as a symbol of our friendship. I got the Devil Killer. It, it, a pocket circuit car? You sure? It looks valuable. It's the least I can do for how after how much you helped me, Kazumi Kuhn. Looks pretty rad, huh? See how fast you can make it go by customizing it. Heh, <laughs> sure. Thanks, fighter. Come back to the track sometime. Can't wait to see you burn rubber again. Alright, guys. 
race you back to the pocket circuit stadium. Uh. See you there too, Kazuma Kiyun. Uh. Sure. Okay, everyone. Get ready. Get set. Go! I'll go take a look later. All right. One last trip to the office, get paid, set the next collection stuff, and then I'm going to call it a night because I can barely keep my eyes open. Wow, we made big bucks tonight. How much big bucks? Uh, we are up to 1,576,881,382 yen. Holy shit. Can I borrow some? Sure, here you go. <laughs> wow, thank you. Imaginary money. It's what I always wanted. Well, now it's what you got. Yeah. Hey, do you know how hard it is to make this much uh, non-existent money? I gotta stand around for hours while everybody else does the work for me. Oh. Miracle Jackson. You sure do pay Miracle Jackson a lot. Alright. That's good. We do need more security for this. So let's... Uh, who's good to have? Yeah, we'll put you on. Do need new security here. Eh, we'll put the new guy on. Alright. And now that that is done, it is time for us to call it a night because I am barely awake. He seemed fine until you saw the clock. <laughs> yeah, basically, just time punched me right in the face and just like, oh, hey, it's this hour. Oh, no, it's this hour. Oh, hey, it's three, brain. Uh, uh I have to be sleepy. All the sleepy all at once. <laughs> I'm just looking. Oh, hey, it's three p.m. That is going to do it for tonight, everybody. Thank you all for stopping by. We should have this real estate stuff done on Friday. And then we can finally, finally, FINALLY go back to the main story. Yeah. And I will be really happy to be done with this real estate, even though it has been a very uh, good way to make money in this game. Holy hell, I need I need to change the scenery. I'm so sick of being a camera road show. So, Tamo, I'll let you pick. What should we raid with tonight? Should we raid with Kazuma Kuhn or Shroom? Shroom. Always Shroom. It's the best topping on pizza. Don't, don't let Dragon or Moon hear you say that. <laughs> well, they're blasphemers, so they're not to be taken seriously. Uh, who the hell is still streaming at this hour? Probably no one. You know, it goes great on mushroom pizza. If you say anchovies, I'm gonna, I'm going to. Oh fuck no! Anchovies don't go good with anything. Okay. Don't, if you say pineapple, I'm not saying it's not pineapple. How dare you? <laughs> Especially with ham, like 
it all goes good, really okay, good together. If, it, if, if it's like a Hawaiian pizza, I can understand, but if it's just like just pineapple everyone mushroom, say it's Hawaiian. just no. Uh, what do we got? Oh, why? Nope, nope, nope. Uh, who's, who's streaming right now that's not late into the game? Uh, pineapple pizza usually does not have mushroom. Cheese, pineapple, and either ham or bacon. Okay, that's why it keeps saying, oh, it's Hawaiian pizza. I'm like, no, it's not. It has mushroom. <laughs> why, why is someone playing Bug Fables on the Yakuza thing? Did they forget to change their, their thing or something? else that's playing Yakuza seems to be pretty uh, deep into the story, so I guess we can just go raid John. Yeah, we'll just raid John tonight just because I can't really find anyone else right now. Oops, why did they go to that? to the past VOD is going to be going up. Hopefully, whenever I wake up, I'll just immediately upload it and then probably just go back to sleep. Uh, let's see. Tomorrow night, of course, uh, continue Bayonetta. Friday, Yakuza, more of that. And then Saturday is up in, up in the air, to be honest, because I'm not sure what we're going to be doing. Anyways, thanks everybody for coming out tonight. I will see you all later. I'm going to be trying to work on getting some slice stuff out, so hopefully I can get that done because I did uh, manage to get that audio uh, bug fixed. Alright, good night everybody.